Or we have. We, we have, and we are live. We're both. We did. We are, and currently am. <laughs> we am live. We, we are live. Everyone, we am live. <laughs> um, so tonight we're doing something a little bit different. We've got the big Christmas special uh, next Sunday, so we're changing days. It's not the usual Monday night. Um, and Joe's going to be running it. Joe's going to be DMing no, or being I'm, for the first time. I'm so ready to crash and burn. I'm excited. Yeah. Let's do this. It's the best way to do it. It's the best way to happen, I think. Um, and we're going to be doing Call of Cthulhu, which is going to be cool. Nice Christmassy Call of Cthulhu um, story, which I haven't bought yet, but I will because it looks pretty sweet. I don't know. I don't know much about it other than it's definitely Christmassy themed and called Silent Night. So it sounds pretty spooky. Oh. Yeah. Um, and then and set in the early 2000s and set, yeah set in the <laughs> early 2000s instead of like 1920s which is like the which majority. no one told me <laughs> <laughs> it was mentioned i'm pretty certain it was mentioned like when we first started talking really? about mm. this. Oh, oh ages ago i've been yeah, thinking yeah. about it and i'm like i can't <clears throat> think of like what defines the 2000s i think because i was a like, young person at the time i'm like blind to the foibles of the era yeah. Eminem. He was Eminem. Oh, Eminem. Bleached yeah. hair and eyebrow piercings. PlayStation yeah. 2 came out. Yeah, yeah. The Dreamcast was alive and well, or maybe about no. to die. <laughs> no. um, the football club, I thought it was very successful in that era. So that'll be <laughs> interesting to no one. So what was that? What, what was? Oh, so it was so uninteresting that your brains switched off. <laughs> no. <when> I, <laughs> Just briefly, just yeah, instantly. Just sports, Please. just sports stuff. Doesn't matter. <laughs> sports stuff. Yeah, you're right. That is oh, boring. Sport. Oh, yeah. Move on. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, your crowd. Yeah, actually, come on, Adam. <laughs> Mad Men was one of all those images. <laughs> <laughs> when did Mad Men come out? I'm just looking it up now. <laughs> oh no, nah, kind of late, like 2008, like winner drama series. 2009, 2010, so probably not really early 2000s. In the 2000s, <laughs> I think that era for me would have been defined by defined by Pokemania. Right. Mm -hmm. Just Pokemon it was all I cared sure. about, I think. What I'm I'm just aware of is we know that we've got limited time uh, tonight. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> uh, we, let's create an investigator now. <laughs> so. Adam's like, In I've got way, to be gone though, by like 20 past eight. So we are building hour. framework for it. Okay. <clears throat> oh, definitely. Definitely. Yeah, it's all, it's but all kind of not. history. And like, we need to know what our characters were into. Um, before we go live, I just want to, oh, before we are live, <clears throat> before we start off, I just want to say hello to uh, Kalan Darklaw and Girl Monstrosity, who says, hi, it's Tori from Discord. So hi, Tori. Um, for anyone who's watching who's not part of our Discord, come say hi. Uh, and also Kalan gifted Tori a tier one sub for a month. So thank you so much for that support uh, for Tori and for us. A little bit of this. Thank you for that. <laughs> thank you so much. That's so good. Um, uh, Kalan says he wants to wish Adam best wishes with his production this weekend if he's not too late. That was on Friday night, wasn't it? Or Friday, Saturday, double. Oh, and it was a cracker. I tell you what, if you oh. weren't there, oh, you'd be regretting that for I, the rest oh. of your lives. I didn't know it was on Friday and Saturday. I swear your little thing that you put up in the background just said the Friday night. Well, there was, I, well, there was one show on the Friday night, and then there was a different show on the Saturday. Oh. The Saturday night was just all me, 60 minutes oh, of me. What? But I actually went for 90 minutes, and it was... <gasps> okay, now, oh, I'm annoyed annoyed you, now I'm annoyed you didn't tell us about that one, because I, I absolutely... I did. I, did. I said about both of them, I Thing. What? No, no, you didn't. No, you only the Friday night one. No, no. <laughs> okay, is again. Time is of the Ruin this friendship outside of this. I can't I mean, believe it. I, I mean, would have, because uh, Joe was really gutted because I had something else on the Friday night. We're like, well, yeah, I I'll can't be like, go. We're going. And you're like, no, but I had, fun. I had nothing planned, uh, like officially with anyone, like social activities for Saturday night. We could have totally, God damn it. All right, I'm turning off the stream. I'm too upset. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll grieve, we'll grieve that out Thanks, later on. on. Let's get on to the investigators. <laughs> Thanks, Kalan. Yeah. yeah, let's just, Joe, take it away. Okay, I know what I'm doing, by yeah, the way. Yeah. For real. Stated. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so you have your character sheets there. We just have to build them. 
Luckily, yes. I think it does a lot of the maths for you because the maths look pretty annoyingly hardcore. Um, um, and the viewers get to watch my character screen. I don't think I have access to seeing everyone else's. Uh, okay. So is there the capability of rolling for them on these sheets? I believe, look, we're going to go through this together. Let's find we're out. We're going to go through. Actually, can you, um, just for the sake of the viewers, can you add Adam's and Shannon's characters just to my journal? Don't make them editable by me, but let me... Oh. Would this be a thing that oh. we could do? Like, yeah, yeah. See my screen. Yes. Okay. I'll put it in your journal. Okay. Journal. What I can but. do, I can make this even cooler if you just uh, yeah. let's duplicate yeah. that. Uh, copy, pasted. No. What am I doing? Oh God. I don't know what I'm doing anymore, guys. No, I will delete that. I can not do this. It was just like no, a, no. This is actually a really good idea. Um, so that's cool. I'm going to. Oh, this is going to be amazing. Everyone's going to absolutely love oh. this. I reckon we're going to shrink that down. We'll shrink that down. We'll make that. Uh, what can we do with this? Check out this bad boy. While we're, while we're waiting. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's so good. It's from the actual actual store. Oh, Is man. It? I love that they yeah. melt it. <laughs> yeah. All about it. All right, business. Business. I had that, um, that place as my background on Zoom for a couple of weeks. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like it's I was just, just hanging out in the, in total the landscaping. <clears throat> I, re I, th okay, I think I've got this going, so it should look at least uh, all right. <laughs> and that's all I'm going to go for tonight. I'm going to go for all right. Okay. Uh, all right good. So we've got us on the top left corner of the screen for everybody, but we've got that taking up like everything else. So Joe and Adam, I, what, Joe, why don't you talk Adam through what we need to do here? Yeah. Well, I'm saying that you can either roll for them or it just says you can allocate the following values. Like, so... We could. What, what would you prefer to do? Roll or just pick the thingies, the numbers that you um, want for your attributes? I, re I reckon roll, right? Points by probably takes a little bit more time and it's a little yeah. bit more deliberate. So like, more it might be a bit lame for this session. So I think yeah. I'm in favor of rolling. Go into your okay. settings. Do the rolling and then that can also inform what kind of character you think they'd be when you see their characteristics. Yeah, and go into roll 20 settings, the little cog at the top right, and just activate 3D dice, enable 3D dice, just to make sure that you know people can see the rolls as well. Yes. Okay. One, Done. Enable one, advanced dice. Next one. Enable 3D dice. There you go. Oh, what are we clicking? Because it says, <clears throat> how do you want to make this character? That just instantly turns it on. Uh, uh, <clears throat> character Mansa, create an NPC. Manual, edit I think sheet it directly. is. Edit sheet directly is what we want. Is it? I don't know. Is it? I'll have a look. <laughs> oh, there's like a full-on character Mansa thing. Do a character Mansa. Let's do character Mansa. Okay, like I'll it click it. Does it just make a character? No, do, 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 it's do, like do, a do. wizard, I guess. But don't... Don't go through it yet. Um, Adam, okay. can we reset yours so you can go through Character Mancer? I don't know how to do that. <laughs> it's stuck already. Uh, just, cre <laughs> just create a new character, Joe. For um, So in, <sighs> the, in the journal up the top, there'll be like a little add button and then yeah. click that and then click character. This is going to be, a, by the way, viewers... I'm really sorry you're watching this one. This, okay. is like, this, is, this is us just like figuring stuff out tonight. Um, hey, yeah. Shannon, um, I'm going to you because I consider you a bit of a um, knowledge font on like lots of random stuff. What was that? What was that guy's name who was involved in the the Vietnam War? Who was it? Macan Mac Mac <laughs> Not Ma Kaylee McEnany. Machiavelli. <laughs> <So Machiavelli. laughs> Mac Mac uh I know what the last name I want is for my character. It was like Mac and the Me or something, but then I wrote it down. I was like, that was definitely not, not it. Mac Vietnam. Vietnam. Mac and the Me? me. What you, how was he involved? He was an American. <laughs> there is a, <laughs> that's not a Vietnamese name, then you're saying. <laughs> okay, that, that does narrow it down. Thank you. No, but what did he do? McDonald's. McNamara. McNamara, that's it. Yeah? yeah. Is I want it? Name like McNamara. Oh. Robert McNamara on Wikipedia. Was an yeah. American business executive and the eighth United States Secretary of Defense. All right, so uh, Adam, close, close Harry for a moment. Just close that. 
top right. No, that was just, yeah, that's... <laughs> Um, the top oh, right yeah. there, yeah, yeah. Uh, and click on your new Adams character there at the top. Yeah. And then, okay. uh, Joe, have you given him edit and ability to that character? I thought I did. I don't think you have. Why? Oh, I gave it the control to you, Reagan. Here we oh. go. This might help. Uh, close. Just don't worry about Henry. Harry, you can close. I'm just making a Harry one, so when it overwrites, <laughs> it's not like that's good. Okay. All right, click All right. use the okay. character mancer. Should I make this real? How big do you want this? Yeah, that's fine. I think that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, cool. That'll be right. Use the that's character good. mancer. I wish I could pop that window out, just that view, it's but fine. I can't. It's fine. It's good. I'm thinking about the viewers, Joe. I'm thinking about the viewers. <laughs> I never am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm just trolling. Are we okay. ready to go yeah, yeah. Next? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's see what this character. Oh, let's see, it gets you to roll them. There's like That's a full. Cool. Ro should oh, we wow. all. Are we just going to do one or two? Should we just focus on Adam? So, or should we just do all of ours okay. at the same time? No, let's just focus on Adam. <laughs> yeah, let's Adam. do that. It's all about Adam. I re <laughs> Why? Why? Oh, Adam. Adam. We've done. I think <laughs> I think if he's going to name this character, I think it could be Harry. I think Where do is, I put the name? Not Robert McNamara. It'll be. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think that might be That's his name coming. So there's a roll all button there, which I think is gonna get you some stats. Yeah. yeah? All right. Let's see what Harry McNamara is all about. Oh, this is taking this fucking sweet time, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, what's it doing? <laughs> it, makes like well little, it makes oh oh, oh. oh. Ooh, ah. Ooh, there was a lot Look of that. Dive. And the problem is we don't know. Are those good numbers? Oh, he's a bit good looking, though. Appearance. The higher they are, the better. Yeah. The, so yeah. Appearance okay. Because you have to roll under yeah. that number. That's right. So the higher, the, the easier it is to roll under. So what do we got? Oh, wait. Oh, what? Want... Wait. Hang what? on a minute. Why did some of them just change? Oh, no, it re-rolled them. Oh, it's because he clicked roll twice, right? He's gone oh, less attractive. I... No. <laughs> this, is, this is not my real life. Damn. This is a <laughs> A you lot of, I, I heard that um, some places, uh, normally they don't encourage you to have a starting number of over 75, but oh. you got two good 85s there. Is that like he's, a, he's a big size. boy. He's not he's a little boy. He's a big boy. He's a unit. He he's is a unit. Punk, so you know That's what size we're talking about here. <laughs> I've, got the, uh, I've got the book here, and it says, presumably, if investigators lose all size points, they disappear. Goodness knows to wear. Mm. Um, <laughs> Shannon, I believe it was just the skills that um, are not allowed to be over, or are preferred or not meant to be over 75. But like these oh, okay. these yeah. stats, these are just your character stats. Totally fine. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Okay. So it's, it says um, if you have an appearance of zero, you're appallingly ugly, possibly with a wholly detestable demeanor, provoking comment and shock everywhere. What about 65? What, what does that sort of put me? Yeah, oh, you're know. all right. Your, your Brad Pitt is like, I guess, in like 90. <laughs> like, yeah. peak era Brad. Yeah. 65 is like, I don't know. Maybe he's like fine. average looking. He's not ugly. He's Could better looking than your average. Pete Sampras. Pete Sampras. Weird frame of reference. <laughs> 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 You know, Pete oh, Sampras. Sports. Sports. Sorry, I thought you said Lapras, the Pokemon. <laughs> Lapras, the Pokemon. Can we Pete bring up Sampras. Pete Sampras? I want to know if he's a 65. Bring up Pete okay. Lapras. I'll quickly show you Pete Sampras. All right. <laughs> yeah, please. So this is, yeah, yeah, please. Check that out. This is, this what is, my, guys this is my quick um, hit for a, for a 65, okay? Just right okay. off the top of my head. <laughs> yeah, you can see it. Pistol Pete. I can't. I can't it's... disagree with you. I think that's a good solid sixty-five. Think... Maybe you nailed it. Maybe veering on seventy. Sixty-five you to seventy. It. Well, yeah. what about down where it says CNN? That one. Well, look, everyone takes a bit of a dive later in life, don't they? So... That's still a sixty-five. It's probably still a sixty-five. Actually, though, uh, but... I can. Um, there actually is a rule about taking a dive later in life. Uh, depending on what age your character is. So once you oh, get yeah. to... Oh, yeah. Okay, this is very ageist, by the way. It says once you get from 40 to 49, you reduce appearance by five. 
60 to 69 reduce appearance by 15 real and then life shit there. from there <laughs> it's like yeah. it's a little bit what does it say for age 40 what, how many points have i how have i changed now that i've hit 40 your appearance has been reduced by five Fuck. i'm sorry i'm, I'm sorry gonna go, i'm gonna go scar my face up just in celebration i guess <laughs> all right uh, He's not found. Okay. I love a good four. That's really nice design, except for how the G and the T touch. I really like. It's really yeah. Anyway, um, <laughs> yeah. so sucks. How old is Harry? Matt Mara. He's. <laughs> do I get to choose or do I roll again? Because he could be like a uh, hundred. Oh. I don't want an ancient. Right? I, I, I th- well, I think I think it's you get to choose. choose. Um, do you, do you so want the, his age when he was in <coughs> office? <laughs> no, I'm not basing um, the character of Robert McNamara. I, I, think like, I think we need to base the ages of our characters off the story. So the story involves a bunch of, like, I think it, it sounds like a bunch of people that have come together to someone's house to have a, a party, and then there's a yeah. blizzard and no one can leave. So if oh all of our God, characters... All of our well, characters. Robert McNamara kind of... died in 2009, so you'd be fucking old. Here we go. <laughs> Showed up for no. an early 2000s party. So it's like a, is it a mid mid to late 20s kind of vibe? Like I we're think like, so, eh? how old we are. Yeah, yeah I think that works. In the prime. 27, and that way if I die, it'll just be just another tragic addition okay. to the uh, 27 club. <clears throat> ah, yeah. Excellent. Okay. Improvement roll. Make, Make it an improvement it. roll. Oh, this is what the guy was going sure. on. You roll something, and then something happens. If, yeah, you're a, like... if you've got it over or something, then you can do that. Yeah. To do 10, maybe? Oh, here we go. What did you roll? I, I can't say. I couldn't tell you if I wanted uh, to. An improvement <laughs> roll. 77. It was a failure. So you had to roll over 84. Why did you have to roll over? Oh, it was about has, education. You know, his education is high, so yeah. it's hard to beat. He already okay. is super educated. You had to yeah. try and roll over... 85. Fair okay. one. Well, that, that would be tough. Yeah. Secondary yeah. characteristics. He's, he's a big boy and he's a smart boy. So all of your sanity, your hit points and it's movement rate brain. has all been sorted via your like size and intelligence and, and stuff like that. So it's good that we didn't have to figure that one out. What's Bill? For the viewers at home, what, like, are these good? Yeah, <laughs> has anyone is anyone that's watching have has anyone played this before? We've played like once, and we I just think used great. You're doing characters. great. Yeah, I think you've got <laughs> some 85s right. there, which is like top tier. Yeah, yeah, and you've good. got a build of one. So does that mean that you're really, lucky, but your build is one? Or or like skinny, maybe like super lanky. Maybe yeah. we don't know. Okay, can you Steven hover Hawk. over that? Does Hang it give on. you information if you hover over the build? Nothing. Nah, I'm trying to figure that out. Joe, yeah, we got the rules there. Tell You'd us think I would build. know this. You'd think I would know this, but I can't. Okay, so build is a scale of combined size and strength. One. So it's calculated really? from your strength and size together. So is one good? One is, one is good. It's like a plus one. Hello. So oh, it's right. actually really good, not really low. So the best okay, you can get okay. is plus two, and he's a plus one. So oh. he's a good, strong man. You've got some strong like way. you've got weight behind your, your fists. I think. I think that's what's going to yeah. happen there. But the, the, the beast from the chase. That's how I'm imagining this character now. <laughs> <laughs> For our American uh, viewers, Google it. Because yeah. <laughs> we're not telling you about. He it. is fucking smart, though, isn't he? Yeah. yeah so it's like let's put this in a more. <laughs> Let's put this Immersive. in a more understandable context. Like, which Avenger would he be? <laughs> he'd be like... Which, <laughs> which, oh, which character... Be... Wait, wait. Which character from Akira would he be, uh, Adam? Oh, yeah. No, which madman would he be? From he'd be Tetsuo when Joe. he transforms into a... Yeah, woman. yeah, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> I don't know what any of that means. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What's up next? All right. What's up next? Okay. Look at his magic, though. Proud of him. He's got <clears throat> eight. Custom. Credit rating? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Zero to 100. It's weird, isn't it? Yes. How, do I, how do I adjust this? Oh, you can Credit sleep rating. new occupation. And... Oh, okay. Credit rating now. Choose uh, an occupation above. Custom. Well, there is none. There's only custom. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Well, well, well uh, up your... Up, 
occupations <laughs> right at the top of the screen. Can you click that? Uh, I think that's the tab that he's on. Right uh, at the top. It's already got a little yellow underline under it. I think this is the occupation. Oh, so you're tab. in the occupation yeah. thing now, are you? Yeah. I'm oh. gonna I'm gonna say helpful. that I think the occupation section is broken. Well, let's. I've got the book here as backup, so okay. it has limited effect during the game. It is a, simply a basis for your starting skills and helping to define the backstory. So, right. uh, and an occupation ties together a cluster of skills. So, for example, if you're an antiquarian, you'd be good at appraising and art and craft and library use and stuff. I can imagine so a 27-year-old antiquarian in, in the early 2000s. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's probably more <laughs> more of the vintage. I don't know if you um, get so, uh, 100 trillion points. Uh, oh, points. such a stickler <laughs> for the rules. <laughs> how do you... Um, I can't know if you work out the credit rating. This is so... The lower, the better. What's the... How many skill points do we get, Joe? I'm trying to figure that out now. Because there's like a, a freaking chart. I don't know. Wasn't it like you had to like multiply some points together or something? <laughs> God knows. Bit of an upsell going off during the session. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh, maybe because we don't have like the fifty-five US dollar add-on that what? we don't get all of the occupations. Which list of money? Okay, no so, money. so um, basically, pick an occupation. Just you, you can one. like maybe pick like one that uh, encapsulates his skills like he's a smart Quid guy host. so maybe he's a college educated kind of guy yeah or something it's going to be what was dan Aykroyd's character in ghostbusters Ooh. well he was a professor mm. was he a psycho analyst of some sort or am i thinking uh, of billy crystal and analyze this well he worked oh, with egon he, he did paranormal studies didn't yeah, he yeah 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 oh that's right I'm, I'm going to say he's a psychoanalyst. Okay. Slash so you, analyst. It says you can do anything, but then um, <laughs> you have to pick a set of skills. This game was really built for white men. You can do anything. <laughs> you can do anything. <laughs> you can do anything. Whatever you want. Um, so you have to pick eight skills that appropriate are appropriate for your occupation. I like okay. that you've so, picked psychoanalysis. I think that was a good... Well, if I go to Professor, for example, as an example one, which might yeah. be similar, it would be he'd good at, he's good at library use, other language, own language, psychology, and four other skills as academic or personal specialties. So that's just an oh, example okay. of the skills you'd pick. Because oh, but there's, like, there's a million skills in this game. Uh, how many zero. skills do you get, though? Get eight. Eight. Whoa. Right. Or oh, I tell you what, we would have loved a bit of electrical repair when we were you know, <laughs> tromping around that lighthouse, wouldn't we? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you actually, you actually would have had a good chance to use that as well. Yeah. Oh, this I is early two thousands. So, <laughs> would you like be internet use? How to use the internet? Oh yeah, it might be like Netscape. A... <laughs> <laughs> so if you choose professor as your job does that change your skill points and credit rating or is that order already in there no we need to we need to figure out how to um basically figure out it's, it's what was it? it was something times something plus something times something for your credit <laughs> so rating it's got, yeah. on here it's it like says, education <laughs> times five plus something times oh, five or something and you add those i can't remember it's not, Sorry, it's, not it easy. it's not easy but it does say you can you can do it this way instead you can just put one of them at 70 percent two at 60 percent three at 50 percent and three uh, at 40 yeah, percent cool. which might be easier than trying to figure out spot <laughs> oh, spot hidden. <laughs> this guy is all about the spot hidden what is your pilot he's he cool. is now and he specializes in a seaplane so is he a wait? Okay, so first of all, is he a pilot or is he a psychoanalyst? Yeah, I feel like oh, as okay. the what am I the keeper? I'm going to be like, excuse me, just how multi talented is what this psychoanalyst? Is his, what's yeah, his he's a young man. He, he does it all. <laughs> yeah, well, like Indiana Jones or something. You know, he's a professor. Yeah. He goes. Yeah. It's true. But he, he was a, he, a had, he was a bit older, right? This guy's only twenty. Young like. Indiana Jones. He was young once. The movie. One, two, the TV show. Four. I've got to pick four more fucking skills. This takes a while, doesn't it? Well, I'll say he's 
he's a bit of a locksmith. No, Joe, do you have the book? No, actually, can like you... language and stuff. Joe, can you jump well, into psychology? Right, if language he's a psychoanalyst. Into... Joe, can you go oh, into Roll Twenty and yes. just uh, scroll down until you find like the creator character thing? Um, thing yeah. in your journal and just like share that with players there should be if you bring it up there oh, should okay. be show to players yep, yep, yep. I'm in it so I will share it I just want to take a look and see if there's just so when it gets to I want to see if there's some pre-made characters no I, I need all the help I can get I'm not offended in, in the slightest I'm <clears> going <throat> to put it in everyone's journals so okay. that you can all take the crazy ride with me I've taken and my eight skills but then what's the credit rating? That's what I want to know, Joe. What are we... I'm still trying to figure that out. It... <laughs> I'm still trying to figure that out. <laughs> hmm. There you go. You've got it available to you now. So, yeah, I'm uh, checking that out. Credit rating. Uh, so depending on you how can, many it, of your questions. Oh, it's part of the occupation skill. So that's one of the ones you have to assign. Uh, so you get to choose a credit rating, Adam, I think, by the sounds of things. So, yeah, okay. you could e- either put it more, more into your skills or – Start with that as the highest if you want them to be really rich or somewhat rich. I want them to be reasonably wealthy. And I notice I've got a min max here, so I've just chosen a kind of a narrow range. Oh. Average is 10 okay. to 49. Oh, okay. So, but so if, if you're assigning them like to, to the eight skills, you can do one at 70%, so that would be your highest one. Two at sixty percent, three at fifty percent. And Joe, do you have Is the that, do you have the book no? that you're reading there as well? Or I've just... got the book, but it's really just confusing me to have two sources. But it's sometimes helpful. Okay, I think I've got. Um, I think I might have something somewhere as well that I can bring up. Something I, somewhere. Yeah, I think like some of the pre-made occupations have pre-made credit re- ratings assigned to them. There's a whole table in the book. So, uh, psycho. Oh, there's. Oh, could you could be a parapsychologist? That's in the book. Oh, okay. I'm starting to see how it is now. So now that I've selected my skills, yeah. Um, the ones that I actually had something by, I get to like assign occupation points to, and it looks like I've got like remaining skill points to spend on those things to like bring them up from the base. Which in a lot yeah. of cases is zero or one, but that's a hundred percent correct. So that's the thing where if you just want to do it like the easy way, you pick one that gets seventy, and then go from there, giving two at sixty percent, mm. three at fifty percent. So what's he best at? I think he'd be best at these these core skills. Oh, psychoanalysis, which he can barely say is. Why did um, you know? I guess I'll give myself five there. No, you want to have like like 70 if that's your best skill. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. And see, and so like, see how there's like a little one. You basically, these these values on the left hand side, the leftmost value is like the base, your base, every, your specific character has that as a base. Anything that you add on there goes into the occupational. Then you've got your total on the right. Yeah, there you go. You're assigning very small amounts, but you if you want to do it the easy way, you do one at 70% and then two at 60% and then three at 50% and three at 40%. That doesn't add up to anywhere near oh. the level of skill points. Oh, so that, that, must be, that must be if you haven't rolled. So do you have and more than some, that? And some for your credit rating, right? <clears throat> yeah, the credit rating is one of the occupation skills. Uh, okay. Okay. So do you have more than that or less than the sum of that? I have less. Well, have, you've, got your personal, you've got your personal there to add onto it as well. So you've got skills points or uh, skill points from your occupation and skill points from your personal that you can assign. So this is this is points related to my job yes. and this is points related to me. So what, what, what happens is-, is you get the ones that are related to your job that you divide the, that 140 points between and then – just you as a person, you get to just divide the remaining 140 of your personal anywhere you want. Okay. I'm actually completely lost, but okay. Uh, it's, okay. it's extremely complex, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I guess the first time, I like, it, they kind of make, well, you've got two columns right there. So you've yeah. used up your 30 from occupation and now you're using, now you're using up your personal it, points. Why are there only 
only 30 for occupation. This thing no, makes no. it sound like a million. There, there, there was 140 for occupation. He's just doling them out. It's lowering that amount as he's putting them in. Yeah, uh, but it's still not going to add up to the amount that's on this as an example. But I guess uh, that's if you don't roll it. I don't know. It just seems like way more than he had. How much um, is it supposed to be? Oh. <laughs> uh, well. Well. I think it's saying actually, yeah, you don't. Oh, I see. For when you have those numbers I was talking about, like seventy percent and sixty, you ignore the skill base values. So that's probably why. Gosh. Okay. What? It's (laughs) so easy. It's even more confusing. (laughs) So (laughs) easy. Wait. This is how I felt making my D and D character as well. I was just like, this is a bit much, isn't it? Choose eight skills I mean, appropriate for first skills chosen. Yeah, use them to note down your yeah. <laughs> skills can be you can now assign points, but yeah, you you you're doing the right thing. If you get some over fifty at this, like they don't seem to be in the categories, or maybe it's the later part. But once you get one over a certain amount, then the other ones get a little boost as well in that category. Yeah, yeah. So like, if you get like more than fifty points towards firearms, you get an automatic ten points for the, any other firearms. Skill. Yeah. As long as right. it doesn't go over 50. Okay. Well, I've spent all my points now. Okay. okay. Cool. What a relief. What tell a us, relief. Tell us, about, this, tell us like, about Harry. Confused. How many points did you give Seaplane? What's his best skill? Oh, shit. I've neglected Seaplane. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. He's been in a Seaplane <laughs> once. <laughs> <laughs> so he's, and he's, he's, but he's somehow he's, he's somehow he just all about it. yeah 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 he goes around telling everyone yeah i'm big into seaplanes <laughs> <laughs> fuck so, those normal planes i can't go anywhere near a normal plane but a seaplane he can't he's, go wrong he's really able to talk as well <laughs> in his own right. know, but he's got a mega brain yeah, why is how's he so smart but not smart? Well, so Stephen Hawking. Oh. Okay, he's <laughs> Stephen Hawking. He is Stephen hey. Hawking. An enormous right. Stephen Hawking. <laughs> a he's very fast, able. Oh. But neither was MacGyver. Um, useless in a brawl. Oh. Yeah, he's more of a brain kind of guy. But yeah. All but right. Not I'll, talking I'll, brain. I'm, <laughs> we screwed this up. <laughs> I don't think we've screwed this up. I think we're good. I think, we're, yeah. I think the fact that he chose it an occupation specialty and gave it no points is possibly well, not the way to do it. Look, I should have right. se- I should have sent this through before. I'm just going to put something in chat here uh, in in um, Google Meets Beats. Um, it's a list of a bunch yeah. of occupations. So yeah, so we could. If we wanted the, to make it easier, yeah, we could go with a pre-made For the one. future. Um, it could I'm, be an ambassador. For my character, I'm just going to pick one of these. Oh, there's parapsychologist in here. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I was looking in the book. Uh, okay. Isn't that exactly what Adam wanted for Henry? Yes. Harry. Harry okay. <laughs> Roger. Um, <laughs> where is he from? Oh, right. Okay, sorry. Uh, where are we now? We're in the backstory section? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hometown. So this looks pretty. Yeah. Okay. Where is he from? Oh. Was that Los Angeles? Mm hmm. LA as well. I got sick of writing Los Angeles already after one writing of it. <laughs> um. <laughs> Harry is. Oh, they a, encourage you, know, you to say, I am. Yes. Oh, it says in the first phrase. Each entry to emphasize its personal nature when you get to the background entries. I have big oh, muscles. I, <laughs> I like, and I'm just looking through the occupations. One of them is punk. That's my job. What? A what? A, what? a punk. A oh, punk. Just a punk. punk. That's not in the book. It could be a plastic surgeon. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, that, that's good enough for now. I'm a tall, lanky say? intellectual, the sort of chap who bores people at parties. <laughs> a latent thirst for adventure has recently been stirred into Ooh. action. Love it. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, now I get to roll. This is the best part of it, rolling. Okay, I mean, randomize your roll twice. 
the latency is terrible. But um, yeah, here we go. Talk about yourselves while this. Why are you rolling, rolling for place. ideology? Actually, you choose that. something first and then roll. Oh, maybe. Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> well, let's just keep waiting. In the book, there's a um, you can roll a one. It says there's a one d ten you can get. So if you can't roll on there, just roll a d10 in the roll 20 thing, and I'll tell you what it is. Oh. Okay. We'll do that. Okay. All right. Oh, oh okay. It's rolling now. Good. I can jump. Did... I got oh. a 10. It's got to be good. Oh. So you are a campaigner slash activist. Example, feminism, equal rights, or union power. Mm. Wow, you are well, boring at a party. Sure, don't you, uh... <laughs> yeah. Seaplane. A seaplane activist. <laughs> mm. Why are there both planes on the sea? I'm a climate scene? change denier. <laughs> no! <laughs> I ate him. <laughs> Perfect. No, 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 no wait, wait. Way better. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that'll be that'll be an amazing character. <laughs> oh, oh. Hey. that's gonna be so good. He's just <laughs> with everyone else. No, 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 I can't do it. I can't do it. I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't want to be Roosh living in a basement with my mother. Um, okay, I'm gonna be a what? So, so I'm an activist, right? Yeah. Oh, 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 anti-nuclear guy. <laughs> That's, he is good with words. He is, yeah. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> sure. It's a bit of a NZ like deep cut. There we go. <laughs> okay. Yeah, anti nuclear. What are my meaningful locations? Do I roll another D10 for this? Yeah, D10. I feel so important. <laughs> I, I like that thought. we're just picking some randomized locations for you. <laughs> Eight. Okay, so Tell me the location home. that's meaningful. Your hmm? fancy home. Oh, oh fancy home. Oh. So it's take, home. It says take the result and make it specific and personal to your investigation investigator and think of a name for these places. Oh, Brentwood, that's a Brentwood. <laughs> You what? Brentwood Mansion. Oh. <laughs> nice. the, fa- <laughs> in the family home. Mm. Sure. All right. Done. Done. Next. <laughs> Done. Grilled cheese. Oh, oh, actually, Done. no. I'm going to ask a little bit more though. Why Beautiful. is it? <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. Why is it a meaningful location for him? I'm going to need one reason. Oh. It has to be specific and personal. Remember. So, like, what does he? What's his? What's so it's special about it? Where he became a man. Oh. He, what? he became a man. Yeah, where he became a man. At the in the library at Brentwood Mansion. Oh. Was, that, was, was that where he had like a bar mitzvah or something? That was. He's <laughs> not Jewish. He's not. Okay. He can't just say, "Oh, he's Jewish." By the way, <laughs> and I go, "Oh, okay, I guess he is." <laughs> yes, and you have to. Yes, now. and yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's where he had his bar mitzvah. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> <laughs> He Jewish became a man there. Do you mean that he um, lost his virginity, <laughs> just to be specific? Yes. yes or just gay. Okay. For his friend's mother. <gasps> oh. oh, this is for, and he's a men's rights activist. This is amazing. <laughs> no, he's not. I think he's that was a raise. I think that's where he got his anti-nuclear beliefs from. This woman who he looked up to With and began to idolize. Active. <laughs> no, she wasn't radioactive. He got bitten by a radioactive woman. <laughs> My penis got cancer immediately. Okay. Adam, do you agree that this is correct and true to your character? Yeah, to the best of my recollection, it is. Okay. It's Harry McNamara in that show. <laughs> Ooh, making love to his friend, the saucy temptress of a mother. Oh. Who hated nukes. I love it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that, that's probably how they bonded, and he was just like, wow, what a yeah. woman. She did something yeah, about nuclear energy. You know the whole thing. You're right. You're a three mile <laughs> island. Was a fucker. I'm going uh, <laughs> to get my life to the scores. <laughs> mm, okay. Very good. Appreciate the detail. 
<laughs> right, significant people. Well, well yeah. I mean, <laughs> Spring's mother. <laughs> yeah. All the details. <laughs> He's never forgotten her. If she's constantly <laughs> texting on your flip phone. <laughs> My Motorola Razor. Yeah. Um, okay, so you rolled an eight. It's a famous person, your idol or hero. You may never have even met. Oh, Christopher Reeve. Reeve. Oh, Christopher Reeve. <laughs> Post. He's, he was in his wheelchair by this point, there? right? Yeah. When was that? It's like uh, late nineties, right? Nineties. I'm going to say my famous. I've been watching a lot of The Crown, so I'm going to say Lady Diana Spencer. Oh, oh. dead though. Yeah, driving them. Yeah, yeah, fair but enough. she would have agreed with his anti-nuclear ideas, surely. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. And maybe, she... maybe your friend's mother looked kind of like her. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> well, she looked a bit for age, my friend's mother. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sounds good. Um, and yeah. it looks like I have, have another one. But you have to make. So is it? Is it the? Why does he look up? To you? Oh, I've got to make it personal. It says very clearly that you've got to make it specific and personal. Mm. And, yeah, well, you've got a name, <clears throat> so that's fine. Um, I would say that Lady Di and her tireless campaigning for her causes um, and the way that she kind of had the common touch is something he doesn't have himself, but he's always look up to. That's very good. I like it. Okay. All right. Um, okay. I'm just going to roll another D10 for my second person. Five. Oh, you, you get two. Oh. Apparently so. Yes, you do. Your partner, e.g. spouse, fiancé or lover? Well, I'm going to say the friend's mother. Mm. <laughs> Easy. Also called uh, Diana. No. Juliana. Juliana, yeah. It says, uh, um, catch a feeling, start with positive or negative and build from there. Make it intense. Don't build too much. <laughs> <laughs> Very positive, Very positive feeling. In my pants. <laughs> no. Awaken it. Okay. Make sure we're awakening. Alright. Okay. Juliana Sweet. What does he yeah. what how does he feel like she's affected his life or himself as a person? Come on. <laughs> I'm trying to be like the book is like, make it so intense, guys. It's, it fucking was. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he craves so the cool. intensity that she brought to his life. Yeah, yeah. he's never felt it like that way about a, a woman ever again. He's is been... she's, is, wow. Is she still in his life? That's an important one. Or did she discard him? She discarded him. <gasps> I think. Yeah. Oh, oh that's gosh. heartbreaking. Man. Juliana, cast Harry aside. Quince their torrid. Steamy, tawdry affair <laughs> had run its course. I, I like that. That's good. And I'm going to put two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay. Happy with All that. Right. Treasured possessions. Ooh. Okay, here's another roll. Okay, we're ready. <clears throat> Is it another D10, Joe? Yeah. Oh my God, eight again. Ooh, it's like eights. four eights. Oh, this works, I think. It is a sporting item, e.g. cricket bat, a signed baseball, a fishing rod. Oh, that oh, seems this good. Is, this is like Los Angeles, right? Um, so some, oh, it's got to be, who was back in the 2000s? A Tiger Woods signed golf ball. That's nice and portable. Yeah. And an easy item to sign a golf ball. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's, he's a rich kid, so I feel like that would be a good sport. And when he has the golf ball, it makes him feel like Woods on the green. He can do anything <laughs> in all the terms. <laughs> and how did he get it? He's gifted it by Tiger Woods himself. <laughs> uh, just, just like scoping the golf like course out after like a major tournament. Yeah. <laughs> wow. 
guy's been places. <clears throat> TW? Tiger Woods. It's like Tiger's brand. <laughs> oh, it was Is that how he signed it? <laughs> well, that too. Does he do that? Actually, yeah, like... when I do think of Tiger Woods and the things he did, I do need a trigger warning. So thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I just white dresses, didn't he? Uh, <laughs> probably what he's most famous for. At least um, it wasn't his friend's mum. <laughs> <laughs> All right, traits. I think this is we're coming to the end now. Yeah. Okay. We're mercifully on this character. Um, Here we go. Seven. What is his trait? Oh, this is perfect. He's a ladies' man slash seductress. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's all coming together. No wonder he idolizes Tiger. <laughs> 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 <Very problematic, though. laughs> what a terrible influence. <laughs> <laughs> Problematic. I'm just going to say that. Yeah. It says, e.g., suave, charming voice, or enchanting eyes. Well, he's only a 65, so. <laughs> Shiro Tiger <laughs> gave him all the wrong ideals. <laughs> <laughs> but against all odds, Harry can pull at the drop of a hat. <laughs> There you go. He rubs his ball in his pocket to give him confidence. Yeah. <laughs> One rub of his magic ball, and the ladies <laughs> resist. No, no, like, just he does it in his pocket. It makes it builds up his confidence, and then he talks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Talk about nuclear energy and yeah, man. I... <laughs> hate nuclear energy. <laughs> I want to ask, what, what specifically about him charms the ladies? What is it? Just I would say well, he's very educated, right? So he's a, he's good with um, making it seem like he's very interested in... Like, I used to work with this fucking guy who was a greaseball, but his, like, absolute skill was making any woman he talked to feel like they were the most important person in the world. Yeah, so that's... That's what that's what Harry did. I'm gonna base this aspect on <laughs> that guy you hated. <laughs> no, it works. Yeah. Okay, that was fun rolling those traits. It also says think of a distinct look that sums up your investigator's appearance. But I think you already did. You said he was lanky, right? Yeah. Tall and lanky. Um I'm gonna say he's got kind of sandy blonde hair and kind of Bright blue eyes. Cool. Like, I'll, I'll show you who he looks like. I think you should have um, Justin T Timberlake's two minute noodle here. <laughs> no, it's <laughs> <That is> terrible. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Pretty tall and lanky. Oh, yeah. Crouch. Mm. Okay. Crouchy. There you go. There you go. Tall, lanky. <laughs> Incredibly lanky. What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. All right. You should just crop that image that you had right up and use it as your picture. <laughs> he was also a, a brief period, he was a professional footballer in that England. <laughs> but we don't talk about that, that part of his going to at all. Ever. All right. It, 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 Harry, up. 27 from LA. He's born and raised Los Angelite. I don't know if that's a term that people from LA use, but uh, it is now. It should be. Uh, big unit, very smart, very well educated. Um, yeah, he's slightly above average at Mark in moderate appearance. Pete Sampras like, if you will. Um, and he spent all his, his skill points on the on the blow, which we won't go through. Um, he's got a credit rating of 90, so he's super wealthy. Yeah, he, I think he comes from a rich family, Whoa. which has given him some of that shit-headed entitledness. <laughs> He's got his own seaplane, but can't be bothered learning how to use it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I learned the seaplane. <clears throat> Don't know why he has got a British accent. I'll, I'll come up with a voice later. A nuclear-powered seaplane. <laughs> <laughs> no, that doesn't make any sense. Joe, how, do you, Joe, how do you just turn Old off vision. snap camera filters that just decide to turn on? Like, how do you turn on? <laughs> <laughs> you look so yeah, good, No, I, like, um, I, I literally just installed it, and it's like, you might like this one. And I don't oh, like this so one. So if and it's I just on to... the featured screen, yeah. and you turn it on, yeah, just... like so, just click on it again. All right, there we go. Thank you. 
Done. All right. I'm done. I'll stop sharing wow. my screen. Is that it? <laughs> I think so. Yeah. It's so good that it did the numbers for us because that would have been intense. Having yeah. to, like each number that you have, you've got to like have the, what is it? One fifth of it at, at hand. A half and at, a fifth. Yeah, yeah. yeah. On how hard the roll is. Wow, that wasn't so bad. It felt a lot of it like there's so many numbers that it started to feel a little bit like meaningless at times, like the the numbers that we didn't really focus on, but like then the yeah. core numbers were important. Mm. Yeah, there are way too many numbers in this. But they were feeding into your story. Yeah, big I time. think if you wanted if you wanted to do it in an easier way, you could pick like one of the pre-made sort of occupations and just go, oh, yeah, this is their set of abilities that they have. Yeah. Mm. Oh. All right, next. Who's next? <laughs> that was your additional skill one. Nice roll. Nice. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh. What? I don't know. But... <laughs> so it says rolling one D100 CS1 CF96 <laughs> equals 79. So that's clear as mud. Oh, really? Mine says additional skill one, Harry, 79. Oh, right. Sorry, if you hover over it. Made it. It's just 1D100 CS, 1CF96 equals 79. Oh. that out. I think it's pretty self-explanatory. Who's next? You need a skill of 85 to understand it when you're like... Yeah. Oh, my God. It's got like a nuclear... Symbol like an atom symbol next to it when you roll over it. Oh my god, he'd hate that. The rolling, <laughs> the power of the atom it's being misused. Oh. <laughs> Outrageous. Outrageous. Uh, uh, do we should we move on to Shannon's character? No, you yeah. go. Big, big time. It, it does have a thing about standard equipment. I don't know if we want to go into what equipment they'd have on them. A golf ball oh. and a fountain pen. That's all you need when you're out there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's see. I don't um, know. It, it's not very clear on that. <laughs> we can we just can, leave this could be an iterative process, right? We can get like the core character stuff oh. down. Once we once I read over the scenario, it'll be like, well, if they're having a party, like what would they bring? Potato salad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's okay. Potato salad, as an example. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure what the role on that would be. <laughs> Spot potato salad. There must be a cooking. A cooking. Um, there has skill, to be. Right? Yeah, there has to be. A Culinary. Thing. I'm actually looking oh, at the, it's like a full write up on all the different skills in this book, which is quite oh. interesting. So we can look at that later on. But mm. who wants to go next? Uh, okay, I can I can go next if if um, Shannon doesn't want to uh, go next. Yeah, I thought I would, if I do it, maybe I could try a different method. A different oh. method? Because well, I know there was those three methods at the start, right? Does oh. one of them just do it for you, or the character? It was a quick. It was a quick start or something. Quick fire. One was called. Okay. Are you just gonna like? Random. You can just. I think you can randomly generate one as well. Oh, I think mine's. Where is mine? Look, I was trying to find a, a snap cam filter that I thought would be a perfect fit, but it's not coming up when I search for it. What were you looking for? Uh, I don't want to ruin the excitement. If I'm being honest. Oh, here we go. Okay. I figured I could. Is this is this going to work? There we go. Hi. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Like, I, wow. I, oh my god. No. <laughs> this is true cosmic horror. Uh, oh my god. You know, I am loving this party. Oh. I'm cancelling mm. the game. <laughs> I was trying to guess what filter you were looking for, and this is what I thought. Yeah. Way worse than man. <laughs> okay. If we're going early 2000s with it. Shrek oh, oh, can we make it a costume party? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to see him as Shrek. That's only fair. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> okay. Oh. So this Ooh. is my this is gonna be my character for the um Call of Cthulhu one shot. <laughs> I don't want this. No, you yeah, I think I'm, I'm happy for you to play a female fun. I am uh, that is hundred percent my character, by the way. Um all right, so let's <laughs> <laughs> the chat is the chat is not happy. Are you I just want to not the only one. When Scarlett Johansson chose to play an Asian character, and everyone hated that, so I think you should seriously consider: Do you want the Scar Joe vibes uh, coming at you? Um. Well, see, I know a lot of guys that play women characters in D and D, and I know a lot of. Um, I've heard a lot of women play male characters in D&D and I'm just like well, surely there's no difference other than me putting on a, a filter to it's, um... it's mainly the voice it's mainly the voice <laughs> <laughs> I mean um, I mean I could I could I could just give her this voice I guess yeah yeah into it alright we can do that um no. so it sounds like people are just no they don't want okay we won't you can... <laughs> just no <laughs> That's just a, oh, oh, that was see that was just a that's a good one as well. Um, oh, I see what you're doing. You're creating characters and then snap coming yourself into them. Yeah, yeah. What? Uh, I don't know what's going on anymore. Shannon's playing a deer. Oh, <laughs> it's deer. Well, it's gonna be My a Christmas eyes have party. <laughs> Okay, so is it okay? So no, who's, so who's, so so that's a no so that's a no to um. Okay, we'll say no to that one. <laughs> right. uh, I can I can make up other characters. Um, we have time to decide. I can do. Time. Hey, so <laughs> this <bad>. is <laughs> yeah. The Dallas Buyers Club is what I think of when I see that outfit. Yeah. Okay. Well, I won't. I won't use. Okay. <laughs> Uh, okay, well, let's turn that off. I'm just going to get distracted if I keep looking at. I, I okay. no woman characters then. It's for me. Who is going first? Is it can, Shannon? Who's uh, making the character now? I'll, I'll, I'll go. So I'm just going to. Okay, present... are you going to use the char- character mancer again? Yeah, I am going to. Is that going to? Is that good? Yes. All right, we're just going to turn that back on. Uh, let's shrink. Oh gosh, I'm just gonna make this oh, all gosh. working. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Uh, it says I'm presenting to everybody. That sounds gross. Uh, can you guys see that? You can see that, okay? All right. Yes. Uh, character yep. sheet. Oh, what? It's oh, not doing the no. character mentor thing. Do I have to make you a new one and redo it? Um. I don't know. Do you, I don't know if yeah, you, need to. you I could just do it through this. Here. I could just do this editable sheet, I guess. But it won't. Will it do the maths for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll do. Uh, will it? Uh, I'm just going to make you a new one just in case. Uh, okay. okay. Yeah, let's roll a new one then. And you should be okay. able to delete my other one if you need to. <laughs> Is that a, like a Shrek? That's great. It's removed the green. Yeah, oh, true, of course. Of Even course. weirder. Oh, like this one where I've just got the abs on my cheeks. All right, use the character man. So we're going to do this. <laughs> uh, let's roll. It's <laughs> and drag to roll the dice. Boom. Oh, that's what I wasn't doing. Oh, to dra- oh. is that, is oh, it, did that roll? Okay. The previous filter, Shannon. That didn't roll, did it? Well, oh, what's the name of Evil Grin? I feel like that's the character mancer. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, well, I rolled twice just like Adam, so that's that's okay. We'll take the... <laughs> what have we got? What have we got? Oh, it's a lot lower than Shannon. I mean, not Shannon. I mean, Adam. He's not quite so as good on the ground. Yeah, I but don't he's have a lot. He's the same attractiveness, so that's good. Birds of a feather. Uh... <laughs> He's slightly less bad at ev- or less good at everything. Yeah, he's it, smaller, right? he's weaker, he's less intelligent. He's got a similar oh. education. <laughs> he's not as lucky, no. but he is as good looking. So, well, it sucks because you know. it rolled twice. My first set of stats, amazing. 
Yeah, Ug uglier, <laughs> uglier, but um, but more amazing. Oh, um, no. Okay. Oh wow. Are we just gonna we'll keep them. We'll go there. That's fine. I feel like he can be like he might end up being a sidekick. He's a Pete Sampras <laughs> sort of looking guy. <laughs> <laughs> He's yeah. not ugly. Um, I think age wise, he's going to be like a bit older. Like he's the uh, slightly older guy coming to the party. So I'm going to go. No one really invited. <laughs> like he, like someone know, like they, he heard there was a party and he's just there. Is like, he kind of like I kind of know people at the university, but he's just kind of not succeeding. Uh, yeah, no, we'll, we'll get, we'll get to the, we'll get to the occupation. Um, he's 51. 30, 31, not 51. <laughs> oh. um, <laughs> like yeah. 31 is older older than the sort of mid to late 20s that we were going to kind of go for. I think having a little older there. Uh, improvement role, make an improvement check. Okay. Yeah, this. Come on. What is it? So if, we're just going to have to. Here we go. It's a failure. Wow. No, I rolled a 19. Uh, cool. Secondary characteristics my damage bonus is zero, my build is zero. I've got fewer hit points than our good friend Harry. Now, don't be too sad about the bill being zero because that's actually not middle of the road. There's nothing more middle of the road than but my does it go negative. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> kind of what defines him. Yeah, it's What's like really kill. Oh, wait, yeah, we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. He had more magic <laughs> points. He had more magic points so that he can have that. Oh, he did can he? Feel good. Okay. Uh, choose an occupation. Well, we don't have. I've got like a list of occupations that I've just um i've got here and i think oh, there was there was one that i was looking at that i was like that seems pretty good uh where was it <clears throat> i feel like here we go i'm gonna go i'm gonna go with race car driver he is like an up-and-coming oh, cool. race car oh. driver that is up and coming at 31 i think he's up and come <laughs> <laughs> True. Oh, boy. all right he's, he's, he's all right he, he does he drives a race car um, no, it's not a job. He gave him one. <laughs> He's driven one. So we've got. You uh, uh, um, drive one. one. So skill points. So is there like, did we get the skill points right before? Do we just have two hundred? Is that what was happening? I have no idea. It, that bit confused me, and I could not figure out and how those points were divided. Min max credit rating. I'm like, okay. Uh, I don't know. All right, add skill. So I'm trying to think that out. Honestly, we have drive. Automobile. Oh, yeah, so like, a racing car. <laughs> so, like for in the book, right? For the sample of occupations, it gives you the min max of the credit rating next to the occupation. So oh, did that, right. Oh, was did, that on that, that you had? No. No. Okay. Well, let's. Oh, see wait. Income. Find... It says widely variable. Ooh. Okay. So I think he's not doing great. He's doing all right. Sometimes he does really well. It's variable. It's under Sometimes not. In the book, which could be comparable. So give know, me, 20. give me a, a min and max then. Twenty to seventy. Okay, we can do that. Um, Twenty. But to on, 70. on here, it, uh, on these as well, for the different occupations you can choose, it actually has like an equation to figure out your occupation skill points. So oh, I don't know where it, that has gotten that number from. Uh, pilot boat. Oh, my guy's pilot boat. He can, because he can. What? A sea boat. Pilot. <laughs> boat. Very same. Why is he pilot? Why? Well, Why? It says here, like, pilot boat. He can, because, I guess, fast cars, fast boats. He's all about the fast. A racing boat. Fast boats, fast, boats, fast woman. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Psychology. What's his name? For some reason, psychology is what well. we don't have a name yet, but we'll get there. We'll get there. So, like for most, actually, Barry. for most of these occupations, like if this Barry. were like, um, we like an intellectual. In there as well. So, like for the intellectual occupations, you calculate your skill points by, like for example, edu times four. Wait, what's that? Sorry, so, say that again. Just trying to figure out how the, how you get the skill points. In the book, it's got next to like the different op occupations, what like the formula is for figuring it out. Yeah, that's what I thought. So, it's, di it's different for each occupation. So what was, oh. is there one for something sort of race carish so in there? For pilot, it's, it's edu, pilot. Uh, edu times two plus dex times two. Uh, edu oh. 75, oh. so 150. So you get two of them. So, 100, so what, edu times two and what times two? Dex. 
X times so 150 two. plus 100, so I get 250. Okay, so that's more than it had, so that's good. All right. Okay, and yeah, I think I've... All of these are quite different equations depending on what your occupation are. I only oh. get six I only get six skills as well, going from this, not eight. What? Skills, drive automobile, electrical repair, mechanical repair, pilot, boat, uh, psychology, and spot hidden. Unless pilot and boat are two separate ones, maybe. No, I don't know. No, um, <laughs> and you could also get from this pilot one, you could get navigate... Oh, but uh, I don't think he's good at navigate. He's not actually a pilot. <laughs> what about operate heavy machinery? That's another one that it's got. I'm just going to go with what's here. It's six. I'm okay with that. I'm okay. Why do you only get six? No, because then huh? I get to, I, uh, once I divvy up my points, then I can give the rest out. So it's fine. It's fine. So I get. I got to jump. Okay. But I'm going right. the first guy driver. All right. We'll, we'll see you in a week for some uh, Call of Cthulhu. We'll see Harry yeah. in a week. And we should definitely round in the chat on all our characters and kind of make any adjustments we need to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, totally. yeah, 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 totally. <laughs> one, of the, one of us is going to be your friend's mum. <laughs> that, oh, that's why I didn't want well, that's to be right. playing a woman. That's what I was, I mean, <laughs> I, was try, I was trying to do that. <laughs> all right, see you guys. Uh, later. Bye -bye. Um, all right, so I've got one, two, three, four, five, six skills that I can divvy up 250 so points. I'm so shook that it's only six. I thought I was starting to learn how this works. And it says eight here. Why are you six? Didn't he get eight? Um, Nothing makes sense. Anyway, I think I'm going to give uh, 30 points to boat. Why not? Um, spot hidden. We all know how valuable that is. So I'm going to give all... Yeah. I'm going to give that 50 points just for now. Psychology... I don't know why he's just, like he's good at psychology. I guess he's got to be able to read his rivals, all their minor maneuvers to yeah. on on the on the racetrack. Did you pick that? Uh, that was in the list of um, race car. If we go back here, oh, so I had race. Oh, you got it from there. Yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. Um, uh -huh. right. Mechanical. Rep I mean, come on. We're gonna Gotta bump. Good, right? We're gonna bump that right up. He's gonna be and electrical. Rep uh oh sorry no, let's drive drive he's got to give some good points to oh yeah well uh, no, it's just help. zero in the... <laughs> <laughs> all right let's that's why it's so variable right income <laughs> it doesn't say that he was good at it that's true i'm gonna drop down the repair because he doesn't do the repairs uh he's just watched I mean? someone do it and we'll give him some yes. I'm, I'm giving him a credit rating as well so i've used up the occupation skills um now i've got 130 points that i can sort of give to anything that i want to now um but I, but it still needs to make sense in regards to um why is there two psychoanalysts what about Analysts? ride I saw, I saw that he's really good at just being a passenger as well as driving what is ride i assume that's like horse riding or riding something right i'll get back to you on that or is it riding a bike i'm not sure i will get back to you. navigate he i'm gonna give him I don't think that's ever going to come in handy, if I'm being honest. Um, I feel like that could come in handy. Yeah. Okay, do you want to know about from ride? one place to the next? The You're... skill is intended to apply. This is ride, so okay. it may not be good. The skill is intended to apply to saddle horses, donkeys, or mules. <laughs> <laughs> and right. grants knowledge of basic care of the riding animal, riding right. gear, and how to handle the steed at a gallop. Okay, so this I'm going to put like some points into... Um, charm i think is a good one so charm is he's going to boost that up uh he's, he's a race guy he's using like yeah i race cars yeah <laughs> yeah i race cars i'm a race car i'm a race car <laughs> he's a bit confused about what it actually means um, can you send me that list of occupations again if you uh it's just in the in the oh do you because you logged no, in because i had to you? close it and it disappeared okay there we go it's back in there now um i I'm strangely just going to give him like some points for a praise. This guy, for some reason, he can look at like things and be like, I know how much that costs. Yeah. Because yeah. he has to sell all of his shit all the time <laughs> <laughs> due to his fluctuating income. Um, all over the place. He's going to be really good at, he's going to, I'm going to give him some, some points in dodging. Um, I think oh, yeah. quick reflexes. He's he started well, he to give to dodge cars, bit of a, isn't he? He's yeah. coming off a slime, slime ball. Um, fast <laughs> on the racetrack, fast talker as well. 
So we're going to give Ooh. him some fast talk. Okay. I guess. Do I want fast Take talk? It. Now that's a little, no. You know what? I don't want to have to role play fast talk. <laughs> no. Why not? You'll be good at it. You can do that. <laughs> um, what else? Uh, he's a, okay. <laughs> okay. I'm going to give him some points in locksmith because he has locked himself out of his race car way too many times. <laughs> Do they have locks? I don't think they do, but... <laughs> do they even have keys? I don't think so. And it's um, definitely oh, a locksmith uh, on this one. Uh, can we... Oh, when you're finished with that. Okay, on. Leah, I'm going to go next. Can we look at his stats? Because I've just found the page that kind of describes what the numbers mean, so I kind of okay. want to reevaluate. So if you have a strength of 35, it's below average. Okay, well, Somewhere yeah. between 30 average he's at 35 he's got I'm power thinking. steering so he's he's more av- more healthy than an average human so proud oh, of he's him. healthy well he's got to be he's a uh, 50 for sizes below a human average he's size all, yeah, he's so he's because i mean you know he's got to be small to fit he's in burning race all car, those so. calories like racing you know <laughs> yeah and he's 50 he's average human dexterity which isn't great for a race car driver <laughs> <laughs> Well, he doesn't really have to, but he's good at dodge. He's only good at dodging but, things. <laughs> he never gets hit, but he never wins. Um, appearance sixty-five, so he's above. He's above uh, average, which yeah. is fifty. So yeah, yeah. intelligence sixty-five. He's above average. Okay, power fifty. Average. So Education fifty is average. 70. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, 75 for education is between college graduate and degree level graduate. Right. Okay. So. And luck, luck's not on here. I want to know what's a good luck score. I've got score. low luck. I actually have beef with the luck score in general because I was the reading this. The good, right? It, it's cool. No, no, I have beef with it because it's like not only if you're older, you get less attractive, but it also like decreases. It doesn't even give you any like commensurate. Yeah. Pro, there's no old. pros like, to nah, getting old, is what it's trying so like, to say. Oh, you're lucky because you're old. It's like, no, no. you're just less attractive and mm-hmm. strong and mm-hmm. less dexterous, but you're not more lucky. Okay, you just suck. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I at least give them a bit of extra luck. Nah, nah. no, so I don't think my guy's very lucky by the sounds of things because, like, you uh, yeah. there are certain points where you're, you might be like, oh, okay, I'm gonna need a luck roll from everyone, um, to see if. I don't know. You put a, a glass or something down on a table, and you can, if you wanted to, you could just be like, "Give me a luck roll to see if that's balanced well." If I don't know, that's a really but that's a really terrible. If a keeper is asking you to do a luck roll when your character puts down a glass on a table, get a new keeper. Yeah. Get a new keeper. Absolutely yeah. everything you do. <laughs> Actually, says you can um, make the group do a luck roll, and then the player with the lowest <coughs> luck is the one that makes the roll. So that's a bit harsh. Yeah, yeah. If something bad is deemed to happen to one member of the group, you ask who had the lowest luck score, and that person gets the bad thing that happened to them. Right, right. <laughs> so you kind of just want to be the least un like you don't want to be the most unlucky in the group. Yeah, I, did, I just realized there's nowhere to put names in this. Oh, surely there is. That's weird. I got to do it on the bio and info. Oh, okay. Let's do the fun part where you okay. find out what to do that later. Like. Okay. Uh, so we're on. We're, oh wait, what happened to my skills? I got negative fifty now. What happened? Where did they go? Why did I have negative fifty all of a sudden? Uh, Must have. Heard. I didn't think I had, but I must, oh, psychology, no, I gave psychology, mechanical repair, we're going to drop that down. Something's gone wrong with the numbers. Okay, it's back at zero. If mechanical repair at minus 10. Oh, okay, well, that's not good. Uh, <coughs> okay, what happened? Why all of a sudden did I get... Uh, let's go back to occupation. Oh, it went back to 200. That's why. Uh, now, oh, oh. now we're talking. Okay. All right. Now we we've that. got it. Um, oh, not three, 30. All right. Okay. Uh, next. 30. Cool. Gender. I think hometown, I'm just going to do the same as, um, 
as our friend Harry, born and raised in, in LA. Personal description. So he's thin. Um, uh, I am very small. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, and fast. Does he wear like little stilts to reach the pedals? I am insecure about my height and weight and have made up for it by um, driving powerful, <laughs> large cars. Okay. All right. That's very descriptive. Yeah, I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, ide- ideology. Do we need more? Do we need any more of a personal? Do we want, like, looks and stuff in this as well? Um, I, have, I have red hair. Um, it really just needs to sum him up, so I don't need to get too granular. Okay, okay, that's right. I think that sums him up quite well. A small red-headed man. Um, yeah, very small and fast. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ideology belief. So we roll a dice for this, yeah? Okay. Uh, was it D ten? D ten every time. Shoot. Here we go. Let's do this. Rolling the dice. A nine. <laughs> <laughs> Money is power, and I'm going to get all I can. Okay, so money Very is obnoxious. power, and I'm what? And I, and I'm going to get all I can. So examples: greedy, enterprising, enterprising, or ruthless. So basically, he's really striving for like a um, a, a win, uh, like a. I'm getting. He really wants to take that that major trophy so he can move. He wants to use race cars to get like to the top so he can win millions of dollars per race. Um, I feel like I'm getting a vibe of him being a bit of an overcompensating type person who's just like, oh, a hundred percent. I have money. Yeah, he's like he's literally never won a race, but he's really oh. like he's always come <laughs> like second or third or never like placed, but he's never hit that number one spot, and he's like. He kind of is annoyed with anyone who has taken that number one spot because he thinks he deserves that. Um, so wants uh, to use racing to make mega dollars in a single day, basically. He just wants to get that big-ass win. Um, meaningful locations. Let's give that one a go as well. D10. Let's roll the dice. Backseat of his car. <laughs> yeah, Four. <laughs> he lost his virginity to his friend's mother. <laughs> Man, that should be like everybody. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's all the same woman. It could be like it's the, the same, same friend, mom. and so one person can play that friend. It's just like everyone slept <laughs> with my mom. Like was it Stifler? Me. Stifler's mom. We will find Stifler? out later that that's the ties. That a, what was that? That's a good two thousand reference. Isn't American it? Pie. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, meaningful location is a place for quiet contemplation. Inside his car. Here in his car, he feels like the In the boot. <laughs> in the trunk. He just, like, <laughs> rolls into the boot and shuts it and just, like, closes his eyes. Sometimes Close cries eyes. that he didn't win a game. Spends, <laughs> spends time after a race. Um <laughs> Uh, and I'm going to put like in parenthesis, uh, in in quotation marks, like meditating in his car. And I put it in quotation marks because he's just like, he's trying to waking up. <laughs> he's trying to like kill that anger that he gets for not winning. Uh, Spends time. Wow. He's trying to calm down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a. Ne- we have a negative. Um, he has a negative emotion. Yeah, that's it's, it's like me- his contemplation is negative, like he's very down on himself. Yeah, well, yeah, he's trying to like he's trying to like quench that fury that is just like why is he down life. on himself? Was his um, was his mother sleeping um, with have, his friends? Does, 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 does his mother have really high <laughs> expectations for him? Oh, mother is issues. He, he actually okay, so he's he spends his time in the car after a race because he does still live with his mother at the age of 31. Mm-mm. Which is She's also navigator. Which is which is why he wants to earn the money because he wants to be able to finally get out of his parents' home. Um, He's trying to meet someone at a party. Bef- so he spends time after a car racing, uh, meditating in his car before heading inside to his mum. 
So the key, the basically the key the to these is you have to make it intense and attach a feeling to it. So um, it can't just be like, oh, he has a nice time. It's like, he loves it or he hates it. Like, um, I, I I'm going to say I am desperate for... Self-loathing. I'm, I'm desperate for my mother uh, to not see, um, like... Uh, just shut up. <laughs> I'm desperate for her not to see my um, my anger, basically. I Like... He's real kind of fiery, I guess, but she hasn't really experienced it, so he's hiding it from her. Wow, okay. To see my anger. There you go. Very intense and complex. Yeah. <laughs> Significant to, people. To if, see my anger. To, I, I'm oh, desperate for my mother my to not see my anger. Uh, so I could have worded that way better. I'm, <laughs> Look, it's uh, off the cuff. It's good. To yeah. hide my anger from my mother is probably the best way to put that. It bottles uh, it up inside. Yeah. All right, so we're going to roll a D10 for significant people. If it's his mm -hmm. mother, that'd be uh, five. Two. So one. Oh, he has a partner, EJ spouse, fiance, or lover. Oh, his car. Plot twist. <laughs> I've seen that documentary. Car, um, the guy who had uh, got it on with um, Street Hawk. Um, I'm going to say go. I've been seeing a girl, and then I'm going to say in parentheses like two dates so far. Um, okay. And I think she's the one. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, romantic. he's a bit of a creeper, huh? Mm. <laughs> but he's fast. He's got to get. He's got to go for it. Um, <laughs> he's fast. That's one of his problems with the ladies. <laughs> he jumps into things way too quickly. <laughs> and it, okay. to be honest, he's just looking for a way to get out of like living with his mum. So he's kind of hoping. Is she that like, kind of exactly like his mum, per chance? No, she's actually yeah, because she's powerful. She's got like a really well-paying job. She already owns her own apartment, yeah. and he's like, I might be able to like get out of. <laughs> Living with my mum. She's now. got her own like race car driver son. <laughs> <laughs> Who always beats him in the race? Um, <laughs> yeah, who beats him? Yeah. Uh, okay. We're going to do another D10 for a second uh, significant person. It's an eight. Oh, what? We got the same thing for both of these characters. So it's a famous person. A famous Your person. idol or hero. I mean, you who's, who's, a, who's a racing driver yeah. from like the... Um... Shall we... What? Should we roll again? Keeper, I'm taking three roll so it's not too similar for each character. Dale game. Earnhardt. I was going to say we could have like a... Ra a ra I literally rolled Dale. another eight. <laughs> okay. Um, I won't accept it. Okay. We'll roll another one. I'm the keeper. This a is seven. my first power trip. Okay. Seven. Childhood friend. Oh. Um. Okay, that's a childhood friend. Uh, my best. I mean, you could. You know, no, that's all right. My best friend. Um. Uh, Kevin. Kevin. I was gonna say, like, you could make it one of the other characters in the game. Mm. Oh. I, I I was gonna say that my best friend Kevin is also like my navigator. <laughs> like we've been okay. we've been through this your wingman together on this ride forever like from from oh, i see like the he's shorter than you <laughs> <laughs> he's even shorter than i am Makes and you he's, feel he's good. like that he's he's like my pit crew lead we'll say that he like okay. leads my okay. pit crew. what's the specific and personal thing that relates to him what's this very strong emotion about this character uh basically without him in my life, uh, I'd be home. <laughs> Listen, that doesn't make sense. He's living with his mum anyway. <laughs> but he'd have no, maybe he'd have no self esteem without this one um, guy who constantly oh. pumps him up. Without him in my yeah. life, I think like I wouldn't be. Yeah, yeah, I would. I wouldn't be as fast. <laughs> he's just he's he's like the hedgehog. This is things. <laughs> he's Aww. like literally his best friend because he just helps his car go faster. This guy has such issues. <laughs> Maybe he's the one that like encourages him to get along, with, like to hide his anger. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, he, with um, if you, view it, if you view it in the context of the one shot, Kevin's not going to be at the party, which might be a true. bit of a no, but that could be a good thing because he's like, oh my god, without my support person, I'm like, volatile. Yeah, 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 I'm yeah, in a right. situation. Actually, with yeah, Kevin, like I need. So, like, he's been invited to the party, but Kevin's not there, and he's just kind of like, oh, man, this is awkward. 
the, these are all Kevin's friends and I can't believe Kevin couldn't make it. <laughs> and now I'm here. <laughs> oh, where's yeah. Kevin? Or well, Kevin's the good talker, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, pump him up, he can crumble at any given moment. As soon as someone points out he's short or, you know, like questions and on how many races he's been winning lately, like without Kevin at his side. What? I said, or maybe I all he talks about is Kevin. Oh, my friend Kevin. <laughs> Yeah, he's a real good talker. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I like that. Yeah, I think that's good. I, I said, um, without Kevin and without him in my life, I wouldn't have the social circle or confidence to race. Oh. Um, and afterwards, I'm going to say, um, oh, oh, did you know that Kevin? And then I'm going to just put like a couple of <laughs> ellipses after that to be like, yeah. saying, like oh, you know what Kevin thinks about this, or like, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Kevin. Oh man, if Kevin was here, oh, he would have been all over this. He'd know what to do. He <laughs> uh, can fix any engine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna um, a treasured possession. Here we go. A one. A one. An item connected with your highest skill. Which would oh. be what? Uh, skill. Oh, damn skill it! Which... Just friggin' every time I go back to occupation, it's like let's drop this down. And same with the credit rating. What's going on? Yes. Okay, so highest skill is well I've, I've got i'm not gonna oh wait 75 i think i put too much into spot hidden if i'm being honest i'm gonna i'm gonna, <laughs> I'm, gonna <laughs> drop, I'm gonna drop spot, spot hidden down a little bit put a bit more into drive auto um and a bit more into electrical repair i think so is drive auto now his best drive auto is now his best what is so it at? written descriptions are going to disappear oh good they're still there so my treasured position has to have something to do with drive auto i mean yeah. you know where this is going to go right it's his like uh he's okay it's the it's the oh, early it's 2000s it's the early, he's got a magic eight ball on his gear on his gear oh, stick yeah. so it's okay. his lucky magic eight ball that he puts on his gear. uh there's one, one of those lucky that... fuzzy dice which is pretty good as well but can like does he carry he has to carry it around magic eight ball is enormous you can get like miniature ones that you can screw onto like your um, gear stick. Screw. How do I know what? this? How do I know this? <laughs> yeah, did you have one? Yeah, I had like I had so I said something. I didn't have that one. I had something else that you could plug in. It These are ones that you ask a question to, right? And it comes up with yeah, yeah. maybe not. Yeah, yeah. But I think it was literally just like an eight. Ball oh, okay. Without the... Anyway, uh, so he has to have it. He has to carry it with him. Yeah, I think oh, his so. car keys. His car you keys. two could combine uh, your balls. One's got a golf ball, one's got a eight ball. I'm going to say... I don't think you need to carry it with you, actually, but I think maybe that might be good. If, I'm going to say know. car keys um, with a small magic eight ball attached. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Um, okay, traits... Uh, do a dice roll for that one. Yeah. I got a two. He's good with animals. I can just imagine, like, he swerves, like, any animal that's on the road, he, like, <laughs> screeches, <laughs> absolutely <laughs> screeches around. Um, he's uh, not so bad after all. Make it specific and personal to your investigator. So, he's good with animals. Um, uh, I rescue... Okay, no, I yeah, I rescue injured uh, animals from the side but of the road. run over. <laughs> and then I'm specifically, <laughs> aimed usually for I it. have been the, the cause of the injuries. No matter I what like, kind. I feel like he has a strong love for animals because they don't judge him. Yeah, um, Desmarais said squirrels. It's what what kind of roadkill um, would you would you expect to see in like the sort of LA area for anyone watching? I don't know. Are there raccoons there? Or? Raccoons, I don't maybe? know. Cats? Armadillos. Cats. Armadillos in California, yeah, I guess raccoons, armadillos, deer. Okay, um, what's a coyote? Cougars. Yeah. Okay, I like I like armadillos. Uh, so I rescue injured animals from the side of the roads, no matter what kind. I once got TB from an armadillo, <laughs> <laughs> but that won't stop me. Um, I I, I I'd rather risk that than have one die does he sometimes cough up blood <laughs> no, well, he, he got cured from it okay can you get cured from tv i don't know but i know he you can 
Oh, is it leprosy that they get? I knew it was something. Uh, uh, TBs are like possums and stuff, right? Uh, we'll go with TB just because it's funny. You can get bovine tuberculosis if you like <laughs> got really close to a rabid cow. You know, like yeah. A cow that- I, d- well, I do remember. I remembered armadillos have um, something. And you're right. It was leprosy. Okay, but, yeah. But I don't want to. I don't. I think it's leprosy. Life. That'd be fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're I, gonna go. We're gonna go with TB. I think TB's funny. I think you need to actually be bitten by something. So maybe an armadillo bit of me. It doesn't matter though. So let's um, <laughs> let's review it. He has think... no fingers. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So age 31, hometown LA, birthplace LA. We've got all our stuff. Credit rating of 40, which is fine. Personal description. Well, I think we've got everything here. Let's finish that off. We should, we should find pictures of celebrities from like, I do the need 2000s, to... their profiles. Okay, so his name is Jet. Is his first name. Jet, Jet is his first name. With a double T. It's short for Jethro, but he just gets called Jet. Okay, what, what if I Google nice. resident celebrities from year 2000? His name's Jet Harrington. Okay. And he is a race car driver. I don't think I'm going to get anywhere with this Google search. You could look like um, Joe Dirt. That's quite <laughs> early 2000s. I could look like um. I feel like a, this guy is a 65. Who was the son on Austin Powers? Oh, okay. Um, yeah. And he's like a like short him. redhead dude as well. Yeah, it's yeah. A good, it's a good. Yeah. What's his name? I'm a hundred percent Seth. Someone. Yeah. Seth. It's just Seth. McFarlane. Seth Green. Seth Green. How yes. about no, Scotty? Old Scott from yeah. Uh, but what Soul. was the actor's name? It was Seth. Someone, right? Seth Green. Seth Green. That's the one. Thanks, um. Google. But yeah, I'm 100 percent just going to use Seth Green for my uh, character avatar. I think that is a good indication of what he looks like. Um, I feel that's... like he would be a 65, which is perfect. Yeah, I mean appearance-wise. Let's just see how good if I yeah, use my. Let's roll a drive auto here. Oh, a success! Of course, Jet Harrington succeeded. Yeah. Oh, 75. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah. Too bad his um girlfriend's son rolled higher stop it <laughs> oh you can even whisper rolls to ki- the keeper Ooh. yeah Watch this. i'm just gonna whisper that one to you joe That's... oh where's Ooh, the a hard success hell yeah fuck yeah he i'm not quite drive. following these numbers i will have to figure that out so 37 versus 75 means what well for some so reason you've got it doesn't a score show of 75 the... and yeah. if you roll under that, it's success. But if you rolled half of it, it's a good success or something. And if you roll under a fifth of it, it's an extreme success. Mm. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, Are we done with Jet or is there anything else? I'm just trying to see, like... No, no, I think we're good. We're good there. I'm just having a look in the settings for this character sheet. Um, but, like, the one thing that's the, the character sheet isn't showing that I that I'm surprised it's not showing other half and fifth scores but i suppose it's because it doesn't matter it just rolls it and lets you know if it was a success a yeah. good success or a yeah. hard success i think it just auto calculates eh? so yeah yeah and then you've got bonus and you can roll bonuses and penalties i rolled a nine for that whatever that means I'll figure out what a bonus and penalty does so yeah okay okay because uh, you can also we're... push rolls right yes yeah that's right that's and i'm also going to figure that out i did remember seeing something about pushing rolls damage bonus calculation which we didn't do last time no 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 uh i'm not sure why we didn't oh i've just had a look at my wealth uh i've got ten dollars to spend he's got eighty dollars cash but ten dollars is a spending level, whatever that means. Oh, uh, your spending level is how much you can spend in a day. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. Without going. <laughs> and, <bucks>. yeah. <laughs> that must be a 1920s version. <laughs> that has, has to be, eh? Yeah. Uh, it, um, and if you spend that much, you don't have to take it away from your total. But if you if you go over it by even a dollar, you have to take that away from your um, and we do we don't have weapons, do we? No, we can add them, but I yeah. don't have any at the moment. 
I think oh, yeah, yeah. like maybe my guy Gee. could have like a um uh like something to change his tires with, like a, one of those things to undo tire bottom, iron. Tire iron. Or yeah. Well, I don't know if you'd show up to a party Banner. holding a t- <laughs> holding a tire iron, tire iron. Okay, cool. I think we're ready uh, to take a look at Shannon's. Okay. I'm going to try and figure out what Cushing is. Anyway. Wait, how do I even share stuff? Okay, so um, there's like a button somewhere about sharing. Reagan, you've done it. How do you do it? Uh, the, like no. there is a if you hover over there's like a present now option at the bottom right. of Google Meets Beats. So okay, oh have- Guy Fieri just showed up on my um because <laughs> I was like mid two thousand celebrities. Oh, I think he's late two thousands, isn't he? Yeah. He's, he's, he's still hot right now. <laughs> His shirts are. <laughs> yeah. Um, you know what pushing the roll does though. Yeah. What. But it just means you get to do an extra roll if your character's putting in lots of extra effort. Well, we'll have to. But <clears throat> if you if you make a roll and fail, you get way more dire consequences. Yeah, like uh, the one thing I liked about Call of Cthulhu is you're like, uh, I want to try and um, bust down this door, and you're like, oh, you failed. It's like you can try again, but if you try again, this thing, if you fail again, this thing will happen. It's like it's really cool. For yeah, so that would be a pushed roll, I think. Ah, uh, okay, well, okay, cool. So it means you get to roll again, but if you fail something, yeah, much yeah. Better. Oh, okay. Like yeah, for example, it says if you are searching a room and you push a roll and fail, it might mean you t- turn it all over and risk breaking things, or you mm. spend way too long there because you get too absorbed in it. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Um, anyway, so, no. have you figured out how to share your, your window? Uh, hold on. I'm okay. going to restart something. Okay. All right. That sounds good. That's fine. <laughs> Sorry. No, that's fine. Uh, oh, he's restarting like everything. Okay. It's just yeah. you and me, Joe. That's fine. Now we can talk more about pushing roles. Or, oh. I don't know. I feel like about... I have so much to learn. Yeah. It, it's, I think you'll be fine. I honestly think you'll be fine. Yeah, I'm a pretty. Our powers combined. You will be, you'll be great. This, um, we're, so I think we're, we're going to do like a long ass uh, session for this special as well. So that was one thing for the, the viewers. There's only a few of you at the moment, but um, we'll be making it, uh, we're going to be playing at a completely different time than we normally play because we want to have a few extra hours because sometimes one shots can go a little bit longer. So I think we're going to be starting, I think we're going to be starting like 2 p.m. New Zealand time um, su- next Sunday. Um, and we're just going to go until we finish because it sounds like we've got a deadline of 10 p.m. That we need to be finished well, by. So won't be I don't it. see us taking eight hours. I can't stress that enough. Yeah, yeah, but it might be it might be a good four or five, which would be quite fun. Um, okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So two p.m. Sunday New Zealand time. I, I'm not sure what that is for you guys, but it must be getting. It's probably a terrible time. Is it? A, is, what's the time, Des? Can you figure out what time that is for you? It's about eight p.m. I think it might be it might be a great time because it could be like it Saturday night for you guys. Time. Yeah, yeah, it could be just like Saturday, like eight p.m. or something. Actually, you know what? Yeah. I think I've got like a. I don't know why I care so much. I just I'm just curious now. It's um, about six hours on the previous day. That's how I plus six hours and then the previous date. <laughs> That's how I figured it figured it out. All right, so I'm just going to put that to like uh, two p.m. Uh, New York, it'll be eight. San Fran, it'll be five on the Saturday night. So it's probably a really good time um, for you guys to be able to stop in Saturday night. Just chill out. Chill out with the Getting Dicey crew. We might have a few extras since it's actually at a good time for everybody. Uh, anyway, Shannon, have you figured out sharing? <laughs> yes, I have. But okay. now I have to quit as a game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know why he's quit. I don't know what's why that's breaking for him. Uh, but no, Joe, you'll be you'll be you'll be fine. Well, yeah, we'll figure it out together. Yeah. Oh, Kalan said he's going to be working on a Saturday night. Oh, that doesn't sound fun. That's rough. That's rough. Night shift on a call. Yeah. No thanks. No thanks. Just call in sick. Just have a sick day. Just say. 
that things we just tell your boss things are a little are getting a little dicey and you'll be sweet <laughs> so you had a you had something bad to eat and it's like getting dicey okay here we go shana how many times are you gonna have to restart are you good well this one should work <laughs> okay i had to allow permissions to for sharing and stuff in it all ah, right okay now you have to restart it all right is that working yeah I feel like so far we've made sort of an alpha male sort of character and then the little the little overcompensating small man character. <laughs> it's an interesting dynamic. It is. Hmm. Well, you guys are going to have to help me on this because I have no idea. I oh, When I was thinking I about it. To do the character mancer if you want. Oh, yeah. How do I? Okay. You can actually. You can, I, no, I figured it out. You go to oh, settings. I, Go to in the middle, sorry, down in the middle of this character sheet, there's the word oh. settings. Yeah. Click that and click on start character mancer on the bottom Ooh. there. Done. You don't have to create a new character. Figured it out. Okay. All right. Cause, yeah, because originally I was thinking, okay, 1920s. I was <laughs> thinking maybe I'm going to be. It's not 1920s. Okay, um... Fast forward 80 years. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking I'd be like a, a police forensics photographer or something oh that's cool so that's kind of dark but now i've been looking at all your um they've got to go to parties too yeah that's true hang on but then i was thinking oh i was looking at your list and you had like um bible salesman <laughs> okay okay i think that's yeah all right that's pretty good right yeah yeah something. yeah that's really good Bible uh, but you have to send me that link again. <laughs> sorry. Fucking this link again. All right, here it comes. We got this link. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give the link to everybody in the chat as well, just if you guys want to take it. Can I, can I ask too. what you decided on? I missed that whole thing. Cause... Oh, sorry. Um, <laughs> my earphone. Well, yeah, I was thinking, looking at this list of occupations, one of them's Bible salesman. <laughs> and that sounds good. Or do you think I should be photographer? Well, Bible salesman, salesman gets only like four skills. Accounting, bargain, persuade, and psychology. I don't feel it fair that... that and it, I'm still don't worry stuck about on it. that. It's okay. It's, it's fine. No, as the keeper, I decided mm -hmm. that I'm obsessed mm -hmm. with how come it says you get eight, but <laughs> different abilities. Well, I guess it just means... The, the, occupations are different ones. Well, think about it this way. So a Bible salesman, those four skills, they'll be really good at. I guess so, yeah, but yeah. I'm just confused because it says in this official thing, yeah. like, you and get eight. If you look below at Big Game Hunter, look <laughs> yeah. at all the stuff they get. It's like their contacts are local government officials, game wardens, past clients. A Bible salesman contacts uh, religious publishers. <laughs> That's a, so he's not even a salesman. <laughs> he's a, he literally is just like one of the pub, like he's a writer or something. That's weird. No, you're not going to talk to the <laughs> publishers. Income lower to upper lower class. Mm hmm um so what do you reckon should i be i feel like photographer oh, no, they're both kind of one's a bit more normal <laughs> there is there is that doesn't mean it's a good choice okay there is catholic priest in there as well you're not going with that okay he gets a lot of they're skills not showing up to a kid's party <laughs> they can you can be a catholic priest and in your late 20s I'd be like one of those cool t um, pastors, like show up. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh hey. I, I brought my own, and it's like sparkling grape juice. Yeah. Hey, yeah. 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 Hey. No, Jesus was pretty fly too. Yeah. I know a cool guy. <laughs> His name is Jesus. He had Dude, long hair. That would be stand. amazing. <laughs> you remind me of someone. That would be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> that would about be five minutes. fucking so good. Just I like the idea crackers. of like a um a Catholic priest in a in a Call of Cthulhu world, you know, just having True. his mind yeah, absolutely melted. They could bring red wine to the party. Yeah. Or um or how about plastic surgeon? That's pretty cool too. Ooh, I that's like good that. for LA. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's good. Uh, um I was I, I was thinking of having a um, the Bible salesman being a complete okay um, atheist. Hear me out here. There's also <laughs> it's the early two thousands. There's also on this list hacker. I feel like that is a really <laughs> that's a really oh, good early two like, thousands. Wait, wait. John did say he wanted to play the nerd character. Oh, Maybe we can say that. We can say hacker. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, having a hacker in the like early two thousands is great. Yeah. Okay. 
I'm it. going to be a race car. <laughs> like, you're gonna be really the race good. car okay nice well <laughs> i know someone who might enjoy the fact that you're a race car. Oh, no. or maybe i'll be a seaplane pilot <laughs> um okay yeah what do you think i should i'll roll a d3 eh, out of those three uh, my vote is for plastic oh, actually surgeon. my vote is for plastic surgeon as well to be honest. okay plastic yeah. surgeon yeah i, I need this, this la ever on the yeah. And plastic surgery probably was not even that great in the early 2000s. Well, didn't look that great. You get 12 skills. Ooh. Ooh, okay. One of them's a bargain. <laughs> yeah. So what do I do next? What do I do? Okay, what are you doing here? So You're not doing the automatic rolling thing, are you? Can you zoom in? Can you make that bigger at all? You can. Sorry, I was looking at the wrong thing. Oh, me? Or? Yeah, yeah, you, Shannon. Sorry. How's that working? Yeah, that's good. Just trying to make it bigger for the uh, viewers. Okay. Are you just going to roll all? Oh, where'd it go? <laughs> Fucking thing. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Why? Ugh. You know how I said bigger? What is happening? How? I, how do I fucking close that window? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> well, now I don't see it. Yeah, no, I got to bring it back. Okay. Because I had to zoom in, like, using the zoom function, and then it was like, where is it? Ready? Okay, here we go. Okay. Is that? Okay. That, that's about okay. the same size it was originally. It's if we the get... same. It's good. It's great. Good enough? <laughs> if you could make it bigger, just like the original request, that would be... Fantastic. I'm so scared. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's good. good. Yeah, yeah, that's good. good. Okay, that's good. Stop. I'm not going to touch it again. <laughs> okay, now what? Roll all. Yeah. Roll all. Okay. Ooh. Oh, pretty Ev. Oh, I got a high constitution. Yeah, and you're uh, you're big. <laughs> not a little biggie. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Desmaris is like. Desmaris is looks great, big boy. <laughs> oh my god! So I got a sixty strength. My he's constitution is eighty-five. I'm oh, sorry. What? He's slightly less attractive, which is the thing I focus on. Obviously. Which is great. I'm like as a plastic surgeon, not for great adver advertising. Like he does. Like he tries. Like you know, he slicks his hair and stuff like that. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if only he had access to. <laughs> Maybe his he's, he's had too much plastic surgery. <gasps> oh no! I love there that. There we go. <laughs> and his lips are quite big. He, oh my god! Like he does his own yeah. work. <laughs> Maybe not, but like he's like tattoo artists. They've got loads of tattoos. Yeah, and, yeah. I like that. A, a nip and tuck, even though he's only in his late twenties. Yeah, he's very. He's like Botox oh. to the hilt and can't put muscle on his face. Yeah. Okay. Uh, size of seventy five. He's got probably... like really full, tight cheeks, like like almost bursting yeah. with the surgery. Should have butt implants. <laughs> yeah, cheek implants, and they... like maybe he's got like a chin implants to get like a dimple uh, going. A, a serious, yeah. Yeah. So I, I, he probably looks like a Hollywood sort of, you know, that sort of look of what's his name, um, the guy from Spartacus. But it's all gone a bit wrong. You can tell when you look at him. It's like, oh, it doesn't look right. How about he specifically wanted to get plastic surgery to make him look like Steve Buscemi? <laughs> get out. <laughs> get out. <laughs> get, out. <laughs> get out of my office. Um, dexterity is 50, so that's not that great for a surgery. <laughs> pretty, pretty, pretty average. It's like a scalpel. Uh, average. <laughs> Appearance of 60, intelligence of 55. Oh my power god. Power of 45. I don't know what power does. Uh, Education does power of 45 do? and luck of 45. What does power do? I don't know. I'm trying to find that actually. Um, so, it's like magic uh, and stuff. What's he? Power of what? Uh, 45. So, like 50 is average human. So, power is like your willpower and magical potential. And mental so yeah. stability. Yeah. So, if you're like. <laughs> If you've got low oh, power, you have an infected mind, no willpower, and no magical potential. <laughs> this guy, this guy's great. Don't no re roll this. No, 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 no. Can, that's only if you have zero, not what. Oh, okay. Yeah, you've got you're 45, so you're below average, though. 
He's slightly below average in terms of that. Yeah. <laughs> he's well, big. probably. Do you want to roll out of some? He's slightly <laughs> above average appearance. Slightly. Slightly above average intelligence. Mm-hmm. I think he's all right. He's very average with his dexterity, right. and he doesn't. I'm just have... like, why is he so big slightly... and not intelligent? <laughs> yeah, but dude, so, I'm not so, happy with that. Joe, Look, you are the um, what is it called? Gamekeeper. Keeper. I'm, I'm calling it. He's as a reroll. Oh, re-roll. your constitution is amazing, by the way. I know. I know. That's true. <laughs> but it just doesn't make sense to me for a plastic yeah, surgeon. Make... Okay. Unless all he's, right, he's okay. really good at holding his liquor <laughs> for yeah. an average. Security and average intelligence. I don't as- associate right. that. With okay, I'll roll it and medical doctor. I'll keep rolling it until my dexterity is a seventy or something. Or yeah, okay, yeah. all right, all right. That's what we'll do. Which one right. are we picking? Education or dexterity to be high? I'm say dexterity. I really hope he doesn't end up super attractive. <laughs> yeah, I like the mythos we created. <laughs> I like that. Twenty five. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Appearance of twenty five. <laughs> I need a 70 decks. So. Yeah, okay, again, roll again. Come on. Oh, appearance oh, another appearance. Oh, I like that me and oh, Shannon man. are just focusing on appearance. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Still Nothing 25. Happened. 45, 65. Ooh, getting close. Keep going. That would have been a good okay. one. Yeah, all right. Okay. Does it only go on five? So oh, my gosh. That. He's the same He's the same level of attractiveness as, as, the, uh, as Yeah. yeah. Um, Pete Sampras. Still a bit. <laughs> oh, he's so lucky. He's he's also a big boy Ooh. again. He's still a big boy. <laughs> I'm, My constitution's I'm happy, still high. I'm happy that he's still bigger than Ray. Oh, it's, it's combined. Central. It's combined height and weight for size. I thought it was just weight. It's both. So you could choose yeah. whether you're high, uh, just tall and lanky, or short and big. So yeah, or just between average. average like a good like extra. yeah. Well. I like that his strength is only 35 <laughs> because it's probably like fake yeah. muscles, eh? How they put that yeah. oil in their muscles <laughs> yeah, so it looks yeah. like he's really strong, but he can't lift anything. Oh. This works for me. This is good. Okay. All right. He's quite lucky. Do I press next or? It's yeah. a lot of luck. Yeah, so I'll just yeah. go, I'll go 35 for strength, 80 constitution, 70 for size, dexterity 70, appearance 65, just similar to before, intelligence mm. 65. Power 55, education 60, and luck 75. I'm glad your power is above 50 now. I think that makes a bit more sense too. Yeah. Just, you know. Willpower. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Suppose. How old is he? Um, well, this is a party for what? What kind of a party mid, is mid this? To late, mid to late 20s, basically. I had my race car driver, Jet Harrington, a little older. 29. Because it's more, it's more Kevin's friends. I'll say twenty nine, but he had his first surgery at eighteen. Ooh, what su- what did what surgery did he, did he have at eighteen? Probably pecs. Oh, right, right. And yet he's still only slightly above average. Um, Kalan he's Singh, focusing on all the wrong things. Kalan oh, for his appearance, I think they just Seinfeld. gone a bit wrong. Uh, Kalan recommended making a Jerry Seinfeld style character, like a stand up comedian. I guess I think oh. plastic surgeon's good. Maybe for okay. um, maybe a hacker to resign <laughs> for, for John. Um, do okay. I click anything else or? Do your improvement roll to see if you get a bonus to your education. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you get over your education stat, then you get like extra yeah. goodies. What did it do? I can't see. Um, it was a fail. You're, you, hadn't, you had to roll a 60 and you got 59. So you only just missed out. <laughs> get out. Only just missed out. <laughs> What a shame. Yeah. Uh, no. So damage, what damage bonus of zero, build of zero, hit points of 15, sanity 55. Did you just make it smaller? The movement. Yes, it did. <laughs> <laughs> movement rate, I think that says eight. Magic points, 11. Okay, cool. He's not most magical yet. Wow. I can't remember what the sanity on the other characters were. What the what was? And I'm not sure what the sanity. I can, I can tell you. And I'm not sure what means like it's 55 it's quite out of 100 same. it's out of 100 Ooh, so or 99 jet harrington like has the- sanity of 50 and i can't see harry's for some reason but whatever okay. do i press so next I'd, or? I'd personally prefer my plastic surgeon to be extremely sane mm. so that's, that's okay, what yeah, it, but like, I- when you I'm roll sure for sanity yeah. when you roll for sanity you have to get like um 
under that amount. So the higher the number, the easier it is to roll under it. If that makes sense. Yes, I'm just looking oh, at yeah, the sanity yeah, yeah. for Harry, roll which is 40. Yeah. 40? And your sanity rolls by numbers, doesn't it? As yeah. you encounter things, so it makes That's it more right. difficult. That's right. Uh, should I press next? Or? Custom skill points, custom credit rating zero to one hundred. So, oh, roll twenty comes up here for some reason. So, what do I do? Choose oh, an occupation. Because we don't have the um, actual rule book purchased. Oh, I see. It, oh, I we can do only custom, do a right. custom one. Um, and I am a plastic surgeon. So, Joe, what's the rules on skill points for surgeons? Or then I mean, well, you, you must I have surgeon in there. I will find that. I will find it right now. Sorry. Oh no, it's in the it's in the thing. It's got so, plastic surgeon. Does that not have the numbers on it? No. In our list. N- no. For reason, surgeon isn't included in this book. Maybe doctor will be. Really? Doctor of medicine. We'll go with that. So occupation skill points is education times four. Oh, that's oh. not bad. What's my education? Uh, let's... We'll have to go back to stats. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, 60 times four, so 240 points. Uh, where do I put that? In the put on skill the- points section. Under there, where it oh, says 240. 240. And it freaks out every time you click on the screen. Oh, and credit rating for Doctor is 30 to 80. Okay. Oh. And should I add the skills that are in that list? Uh- yeah. So if we if we had spent the money and bought the rule book, then it would have, you would have just been able to... Selected by the sounds of things. Oh, I see. So we've got accounting. What? Doctors don't know accounting. Well, they've got it, <laughs> surely. Come on. They need yeah. to well, know they something about. To They're too busy in surgery to do their own books. Uh, Come on. <laughs> so we've got bargain, but it's not in this list. Oh. Oh. Can you do our oh, custom? Oh, I think on yeah, the actual. Yeah, true. On the actual list, it's often not on there either. Yeah, there are, there's always places for you to put new skills because it's impossible to list everything, really. It's so rare. Okay, uh, next think... is biology, which is also not on there. Oh. What? It seems but weird. I can't, I can't choose custom again now. <laughs> there's no oh. biology? Um. So, oh, it's probably science and brackets biology. Oh, yeah. Oh, so... okay. Thing here. Um, bargains underneath something else yeah, as well. Yeah, maybe. I don't have it science. Mm. Let me see don't I have science? No. I've got pilot. If you go oh, right. Science is specialization. Oh, yeah, okay. there you Sci- go. There you oh, go. Oh, that's okay. Sorry, we do. Sciences and then biology. Okay. Yeah. And you've also got chemistry. Okay. Now that's a lot. I suppose you've got to know chemistry, I guess. Oh, you got to know the basics of it when you go through medical school. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Uh, and then you've, and then you've got first aid. Uh, I don't need that one. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't learned that one. Um, oh, fuck. Oh, what have you done? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what has happened? <laughs> no, come oh, back. Okay. Oh, no, it's gone fucking... I need to zoom out. Ah, oh, okay. There it is. All as well. Sorry, I'll, I'll sort this out in a minute. Um, <laughs> yeah, I can't read shit. Sci- yeah, I'll, I'll sort it out. Sciences and what was it? First aid. Can, uh, first, I was, was that under sciences? Or I don't know. I think it's just under first aid. Oh, there's a first aid? I think so. Yes, there is. I just put everything under sciences now. <laughs> Latin. Uh, Latin, which I think might be under a specialization in as well. I assume it'll be like languages. That's weird. Oh, okay. Uh, languages, yep. Latin. LA would know. Mm. Well, that you've got to know good. there's a lot of medical terms. Yeah, there are. There's a lot of Latin. Oh, actually, no, that's a good point. That uh, good point. Point. Library yeah. use. Okay, well, that's got to be on the thing, right? Yeah, yeah, that's 100. Yeah. I know that one's on there. Fuck. I should have just gone um, Bible salesman. <laughs> just four things. Uh, medicine. Okay, I've got 
medicine. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Fucking hell. Another one. Pharmacy. Pharmacy. Okay. Fuck. That won't be on there, right? I don't know. No, it's not. What would it be? Psychology, under there? psychoanalysis. Well, add psychology because you need that one on there. It says um, on this okay. list in the book, it says um, pharmacy, see science. So is it possible? Uh, it's under it'll be science, science specialization. Okay. Uh, this will be a joke one. Uh, and persuade. And persuade. Yeah. Okay. But you also get a plus 20 to reputation Ooh. as a uh, plastic surgeon. Cool. Cool. So do I press next? Yeah. Yeah. And. Okay. okay. Just, just so you know, like, I can't see any of that. Okay. I can see it. You can, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, now what do I do? So I got uh, occupations 210 and my personal points are 130. So if you scroll down, you've got um, certain skills, the ones that you added that are have an extra slot next to them. And yep. that's that's oh, where so you spend your occupation. Five points. of them. If you scroll through the down, scroll through the down, scroll down. Oh, oh yeah. You got all the other ones you added as well. Oh, shit. There's like, brawling. Distribute, distribute your 210 points among your occupation ones. Yeah. Okay. And we don't want them being over 75. Is that right? Or? I, yeah, I believe so. I believe that's... Or it will be too, like, min-maxed. Yeah. So as additional skills, it says bargain. Oh. And uh, I don't know. Yeah, because uh, you added bargain. You added bargain yep. in there, yeah. So should I... Hmm, that's got three slots to add stuff to. I don't know why the first one doesn't have something in there. I assume it's just a zero. I don't know, actually. Okay, well, let's start at the top. Accounting, I'm not going to put much in there. Credit rating, I'll put that up higher. Eh? I'm like a, a fucking... Well, that does use your occupation skill points. So just it just means the higher you make that, the less points you've got to give the skills. Yeah. I'll put that up to 70. A lot of these have base points anyway, so you're you're adding on top of what's yeah, already there. True. So so don't feel that you have to give stuff. You can still, you've already, nothing's true. at zero if, really. If you yeah. give 30 to your first aid, it's already 60, so that's yeah, pretty yeah. good. Oh. I don't know how it figures those out, but okay. Uh, so f yeah, first aid, I guess that'd be good if I get, I'll get that up to, I'll put, 40 in there. Uh, has everyone else got library use? Um, um, I don't think so. Oh, Adam's, I don't know. Adam chose some wacky skills. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to go psychology because everyone else has got psychology and stuff. Oh, Adam yeah, does. Let's see. Persuade. I think I will use library <clears throat> use. I put library use up to put 30 in there. So 100 more points. And let's scroll down. So it's only got languages one, and it just says one. So that seems odd. What's what's odd? No, right. it's just, that's just the base modifier is one, I guess, because... Yeah, yeah. So do I have to roll under a one or something? Yeah, to... if, no, if, if you don't... Put in like if you put in a twenty, that means it's automatically twenty-one. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. if you put none in there, then yes, you literally have to roll under a one. Okay. Um, let's do so. Oh, what I was wondering is like there's medicine and there's first aid, right? So what is the difference? What is medicine? Oh, I can. I've got like the different skills <clears throat> here. So I'll look up medicine. Maybe my first aid is really maybe, high. Maybe medicine is it's, like being able to tell what to use or something. Right here. Oh. The user diagnoses and treats accidents, injuries, diseases, poisoning, etc., and makes public health recommendations. So it can be, it is like a, to do with first aid. So what's the other one called? First, first aid. aid. Yeah. Why are they two different things? That seems silly. First aid, apply emergency medical care. So. Yeah, if someone's been shot or something. It's weird that they d made those different. Mm. Yeah. I, I guess the medicine skill allows you to diagnose, 
but it's not like saving someone from imminent death. I'm going to put a bunch in there. I'm going to put 50 in there as well. So it's 51. And then I've got another 50 to go. Uh, I can either put it into chemistry or pharmacy. I don't know what the difference is there. I guess pharmacy, pharmacy is will be like drugs. Yeah, or like uh, <laughs> just really good at writing prescriptions. I can look at that right here. Well, can I? No, I can't. Is no? it not in the? Is There's no in... pharmacy. Oh, is what? it under science? Yeah, it's under science. Yes, sciences. Yeah. Oh, they got me. Okay, so study of chemical compounds and their effect on living organisms. Application of the skill ensures the safe and effective use of pharmaceutical drugs, including synthesizing ingredients, identification of toxins, and knowledge of possible side effects. Hmm. I think I should know that. That's probably on pretty there. good, yeah. And that's all of my occupation points. Now I've got 134. So my credit rating's high. First aid's high. Library use is 50. I might put another uh, 20 in there. Oh, nice. Medicine, mm. I'll put another. Oh, you're specializing. You're going for the real specializing, not diversifying. Well, he's a, yeah, he's a doctory guy. I'm trying to figure out like the difference between medicine and first aid. So can you... Yeah, and I think if you don't know it, there's no point in me putting it in, right? What's because... so... This game is they've overcomplicated it. And first aid, it first aid would surely being will be for like applying first aid but only well, for emergencies. It's complicated because like even the two entries mention each other, so it's like they all <laughs> overlap. Ah. So Weird. read the medicine one. Okay, blah blah, blah um, treating accidents and diagnosing blah blah blah. Um, right, so you might use medicine no. to be like, oh, this guy is sick, he's all oh. sweaty and stuff, and you're like. I'll use my medicine check to see what this guy has. I've got yes. it right here, though. I've got more info. I've oh, got okay. so much. Okay. So it says, treatment using the medicine skill takes a minimum of one hour and can be delivered any time after damage is taken. But it is not if it is not performed on the same day, the difficulty level is increased. Okay, so you get hit points back. Oh, so you can kind of stack them. So it says you get 1d3 hit points in addition to any first aid. Okay, oh. so here's... Here's the thing. If someone's dying, you need initially successful first aid to stabilize them and <laughs> then you can make a medicine roll. Yeah, that makes like, sense. First aid yeah, is yeah, saving yeah. your life and yeah. medicine is helping you get better. It's, yeah, there's right. like uh, the, the people show up in the ambulance and then there's the doctor, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, and yeah. also medicine can bring an unconscious person back to consciousness. So, yeah. Okay. Hey, that sounds okay. Great. I put 20 extra in there. Yeah, so first aid is really for treating dying characters and bringing them back from the brink, and medicine is helping heal them, I think. Mm. Okay. Well, I've got, yeah, a total of 71 for that. That's pretty good. How harsh is this? If you treat a dying character with first aid, they get one temporary hit point, and then at the end of the hour, they have to roll con to remain stabilized, or they are dying again. Oh, my oh. God. <laughs> We're all probably going to die. That's brutal. So this might actually help. Yeah, um, I got ninety more to go. So <laughs> no hurry. Let's say <laughs> uh, someone else has got a lot of spot hidden, right? Yeah, I got um, some good spot hidden because my guy needs to spot things on the track, and also he's so short he can spot things out of the court. <laughs> Just like really anything that's like net on the ground, I got it. Don't worry. Anything on a table <laughs> surface, yeah, easy. Yeah. And he's always spotting, like, money on the ground as well because he's always thinking about that cash. He needs just anything at the moment. that cash. I'll put 10 more in pharmacy. And what's own? Oh, language is own. Your own language, like whether that's English or whatever his first language is. I thought he'd be fucking good at it. (laughs) He's only got a 30. Um, Okay. Well, I'll put... You're Is anyone else got it? You're not going to give anything to Latin. You don't think our characters are going to stumble across <laughs> any spooky Latin sentences written? Anywhere? It would be good, <laughs> right? But as a one shot, I wonder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Totally, totally. But it could that's could. the whole point. It could happen. Yeah, it could. I mean, if the Necronomicon's written in Latin, <laughs> we all know it's written in Ara- Arabic, isn't it? Or... Well, if we all know. I mean, yep, that was something I knew. <laughs> Sure. Well, I don't think it, it's uh, something like that, though. Uh, shit, sorry. Uh, pers- 
How many how many more points have you got? Uh, Eighty. Oh nice. Like, like, I'm what? just gonna dump them in like. Uh, Don't just dump them. <laughs> get rid. I'm just gonna get rid of them. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna put twenty. Uh, now let's say thirty into English. Oh. So I've got sixty well spoken, total. Well spoken man. Yeah, good and uh, bargain. Uh, it's one of his. Shit, sorry, it's one of his main skills. Uh, maybe What's he in history. With? So another fifty into history. So I got fifty-five history. All done. Okay. Okay. Oh, hit, so now the fun. Now the fun begins. <laughs> so now the fun. <laughs> I reserve the right to re get you to re-roll anything that's a double up. Okay. Can we zoom in? Can we make things bigger? I uh, can attempt. Attempt to. Yeah, it's, yeah perfect. Oh, yeah, that perfect. Works. Okay, birthplace, LA. <laughs> Why not? Or I mean, should he be? He could, I think, make him at least born in America, but they don't all have to be born. Yeah, yeah. That's true. Uh, he, he lives in LA, but where did he come from? He came from somewhere a little less fancy, and that's why he wants to make himself look like a movie star. Or... You can wear that Texan uh, cowboy hat filter. <laughs> I didn't put my Texas accent on. Uh, I don't even know that much about like what's yeah, like. I don't know Wyoming, much yeah. Erie, Indiana. No, I, I no, Austin, I, Austin, I reckon Texas. he should come from uh, Massachusetts. Arkham, I Massachusetts. Single thing about that. So this is where all the um, Lovecraft stuff. Ah, oh, is it? there we go. I think it's just MA, Massachusetts. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Personal description. Okay. So think of a distinct look that sums up your investigator's appearance. Oh, okay. I am an incredibly well chiseled <laughs> man. I'm thinking um, almost like Frankie from One Piece or something. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Nice. Oh, no, but not no, but not that. Only be sixty-five percent attractive. Yeah, not, yeah, yeah, it's all gone wrong. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think, like, what I'm trying to think of what a young celebrity who's had too much surgery looks like. But does he, mainly woman. Does he think he does. looks uh, better looking than he is? Because he's had the plastic surgery, right? So he must be pretty happy with. Yeah, it. yeah. Or maybe he's never. You know, most of the people True. are never happy with the appearance. They keep getting it. True. However. Um, it's a work in progress. <laughs> so, like, maybe he's a bit of a butterface. Like, he's got the bod. Uh, I, th I think it's all fake. Like yeah. all of his, yeah. yeah. Like all his muscles and everything, they're fake. He's only got a strength of like thirty-five. Or That's something. true. Yeah. Uh, so, what should I say? You know, he's a work in progress. Um, so if someone yeah. met him, what would their first impression be? Uh, first impressions may be uh, that of the uncanny valley. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like, I could tell it had something done. <laughs> yeah, it could be like an alien or something under there. Something is amiss these features. Um I Have think like I think anyone who doesn't anyone who streamer. anyone who doesn't know you I imagine as soon as they see you but they and they've heard of you they're like oh you must be such and such like they just know who you are instantly because they've heard about like the work you've had. Mm. It's like yeah. Oh, I'm not, I'm typing in caps. Okay, everything is exaggerated on my face and body. Okay, uh, okay. what's next? <laughs> okay. uh, ideology beliefs. Which is a, a D10 roll. We're going to need a D10. Oh, okay. Is it roll? No. I, why did it roll on the other ones? But not? I, I don't know. Yeah, just do it on the roll twenty. Uh, or just, or just roll one of the dice if, if you've got a dice oh, with yeah, you. Oh, fuck. Dice <laughs> now it's moved. Hmm. Okay, what was it? Uh, a five. Five. 
Ooh, mm. this one's a spicy one. Member of a society or secret society, e.g. Freemason, Women's Institute, Anonymous. <laughs> so what's his, like, his big society thing that he's into? What's the organization? Oh. Do you well, want a society or secret society? Maybe something where... I guess celebrities are all get, coming to get their um, their surgery and stuff like that. One of those, maybe so, one of those celebrity uh, like drug rehabilitation Bake-off. things. Oh yeah, where, where, like celebrities go to like detox from their drug habits. Well, I'm a part of that. I go, <laughs> I go there as well, or I meet celebrities at the um, <laughs> what are they fuck the Casey Clinic or whatever the fuck Betty Ford <laughs> Clinic. <laughs> Yeah, what? yeah, I don't know. I just keep Betty. hearing Americans talking about a Mayo Clinic. Uh, right, yeah, that, yeah, it's a fancy. Betty Sounds Ford is where you get um, they dry you out from alcohol, right? Sure. Where do I put this under ideology? Yeah, yeah, it's the member of a society or secret yeah, so, society. So maybe not, maybe I think, not that. I don't know. I think I'll go for a secret society, something like um, uh, some sort of secret doctors. Um, maybe it's like an elite group of people uh, of surgeons that like yeah so they the, their clientele is like no one else maybe you do some procedures no one else can do or I think that there's just a no even do. if I do, I'm just yeah. gonna say I'm grandfathered in and it's just a whole bunch of doctors that you know make sure that they get jobs and other people don't and so he's an elitist, is what I'm getting from this. Yes, part of the elite. So he's a bit of a maybe like he's obsessed with the status on, and being involved in celebrity society or something, because it has to be like a yeah. strong, specific, and strongly personal thing. That uh, okay, yeah, I guess all celebrities and uh, celebrities like uh, I guess uh, Scientologists are also part of this, or so, you know, like. They they get uh, deals with Scientologists. I mean, you could just be part of Scientology. <laughs> no, 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 no. Well, you don't need to. <laughs> so you have to attach a feeling to it as well. So like, uh, instead of an emotional component, like, what does this mean to him? Okay. Um, well, I think you head on it there. Where you, he's, he's an elitist. He's uh, maybe makes him think that he can look down on people or um like he loves uh, the feeling of of being like in the know or yeah knows things that loves feeling that he knows things that other people don't know Mm. Uh, what's next uh a meaningful location should be funny yeah give us a d10 for that Um, as well okay I'm just going to get an actual detail. Yeah, yeah, it might be a bit easier. How, you feel, how are you feeling about this, Joe? Um, oh, well, at least I feel like I've got the handle on what the character creation is all about. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I do need to figure out the rules, and I haven't read the scenario yet. So. Six. Well, I need to buy the scenario. I might, maybe I should do that while we're um, waiting. Well, putting all this effort into making the characters makes me think like, Gee, I hope they live and we can play with them again. <laughs> no, 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 no. Because it's a one shot, man. Don't even worry yeah, about whether or not they'll I live. I don't know. I'm not worried about it. I'm just like, well, with all this effort, imagine if they just die straight away. I think that is pretty common. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because I got a six. Um, uh, a place connected with your ideology slash belief, e.g., parish, church, mecca, Stonehenge. Hmm. So. Ooh. So where, where do the secret organizations meet, I suppose, or something like that? Fitting into Lovecraft, then, because I'm from Lovecraft sort of country, Arkham. Maybe I can say the Arkham University, or or is it what is it what is it called? Uh, but it has to be connected with your ideology and belief, so it'd have to be to do with the secret society. Yes. Okay. Secret society at secret society building. <laughs> <laughs> with a big sign on it. Hollywood Boulevard, Secret Society building. It's Miskatonic University, isn't it? Oh, that sounds familiar. That sounds right. And 
secret uh, maybe um, medicine building it's a school of um, secret society of medicine oh yeah and I guess there's some sort of uh, a branch in LA or something yeah and what's his strong feelings about it oh well he's got his he was grandfathered in but maybe uh, he's obviously a little bit self-loathing. Maybe his um, he do, he doesn't live up to his his grandparents. What he thinks how great they were or something. Oh yeah, Is it? which is reminds <laughs> that he's fake. He doesn't. He's like living for the fake life. He doesn't feel <laughs> like he's the genuine thing. <laughs> yes, feelings of inadequacy and fakeness. Stemming from his family's well um, renown, I suppose. Mm. I like it. To me. Okay. All coming together. All right, I'm just buying that. Uh, oh, renown. Buying it now. So, um, anything? Is that good enough? That one. Uh, okay, significant people. Mm -hmm. Oh, I rolled, didn't I? Is it a D10? Yeah. Roll the D10. A six again. Person who taught you your highest occupational skill. That's not one we've had before. Oh, no. Yeah, that's not one we've had before. Identify the skill and consider who taught you, e.g. a school teacher, the person you apprenticed with, your father. Mm. I'll say my grandfather then. Uh, father um, put me medicine basics and was not impressed. <laughs> no. can, say that, can you say that again? <laughs> what was that? your intense feelings of inadequacy oh, from a boy. young age. That's right. It's stern lectures and <laughs> cutting yes, remarks. Oh. Constantly yep. undermining the young man's. <laughs> he was also very handsome. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> I oh, never no, no. like all the women fell over him. Even into yeah. his eighties, they were just like, "What a man!" Yeah, he was like beautiful, um, handsome. Never had an an inch of plastic surgery yeah, either. Never needed it. <laughs> yeah, not in his day. He taught real medicine. Yeah. Um, uh, but you're supposed to give them the names, I think. Oh yeah, you yeah you do need names. Grandfather, Rodward, Rod Rodward. Oh, no, I said Godward, but Rodward is good. <laughs> it's Godward. Godward. God Rod. Rod. <laughs> Rod, Rod. Well, that's just what the ladies called him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. R Rodwick. Rodward. God Rod. <laughs> Rodigan. <laughs> yeah, Rodigan. Oh, yeah. Rodigan. Rodigan. Yeah. That's such a handsome name. That's pretty good. Stuart Rod Stuart Rodigan. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this, the, making up names is the stupidest fucking thing. Stuweenie. Stuweenie. Stuart. Rodigan Stuweenie. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> we'll come back to the last name. Okay. Okay. What's oh, next? Wing's not good. <laughs> Rod Dewey. Win. Yeah, maybe Rod Win. Rod Win is good. Rod, Rod Win. Rod Win. Big winner. <laughs> yeah, Rod again. <laughs> oh my God, Rod Rod again. Big win. <laughs> Rod Win. Kingsum. Oh yeah. He's yeah, Kingsum is good. Kingsum's great. Okay. <laughs> what a Rodwin Kingsum, my grandfather. <laughs> How could you ever let up live up to Rodwin Kingsum? <laughs> uh, all right, Joe, okay, I'm trying. You, you need a second person now. Okay. Roll again. A I've, um, nine. Joe, I've purchased I've purchased it. I've, uh, we've got four different Christmas it's called Christmas and King Sport and other tales. Yeah. Um, cool. And so, 
the first one being Silent Night. We, uh, by all means, you can take a look at this and decide which mm-hmm. one you want to run. Uh, okay. but yeah. So for rolling a nine, this one's a good one. You have a fellow investigator in your game. Pick one or choose randomly. What? In so your... that's a significant person. Oh. So you can be either the hackers, if, if that's what John ends up picking, or the race car driver, or... Um, the seaplane pilot. What was his action? Um, Fuck. I, <laughs> Harry his... McNamara. What was his... Hey, he was a parapsychologist or something. Yeah, like yeah, that's right. Well, if he's in medicine of some kind... Or para- he's parapsychology. A a uh, Hello, advent, uh, investigator. You can have a yeah. You can have, you can have a think about that one. You don't have to do it straight away, I guess. Okay. Yeah, we'll see how um, John's one comes out. Yeah, yeah. But I don't know if he would hang out with a race car driver. <laughs> right, fair enough. I don't know. He might. Yeah, and but if he's really status obsessed, why would he hang out with a race car driver that loses all the time and is short? He doesn't lose. He just hasn't come first yet. He just hasn't come first. If this guy is naturally snobby and elite, why would he? He would not. This guy even had any work done. Although, to be honest, it doesn't have to mean that they like them. It just says they're significant. That's true. It could be someone who has. You could absolutely detest that uh, one of the players. Yeah. What is it called? Significant. Significant people? Oh, no. What was the role of the nine? Fellow investigator. Oh, significant fellow. Okay, fellow investigator. So okay, yeah. well. You don't have to love them. You might want to hate them. At the moment, it's Harry. Is it Harry? Henry. Uh, it's Harry McNamara. Okay. Uh, treasured position. A, an eight. It's, oh, we've already had a sporting item. Roll again. Okay. Six. Your collection. What is it? Oh. Empty bus tickets, stuffed animals, records. Uh, it might be something to do with um, small packets of memorabilia. Small packets of fat that you remove from high class celebrities. <laughs> Celebrity nipples. <laughs> <laughs> you can make a belt. Uh, just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Celebrity chins or something. Um, I, I, I will say um, uh, medical tools, uh, like maybe ancient and antique medical tools okay so why why are they personal to him what's his emotion with them? um my grandfather had a large collection mm. and i'm trying to get his um approval for my own collection like you like is, is the grandfather still alive <laughs> yeah is he yes. still alive oh, okay. yeah oh. i think so and still pulling the chicks <laughs> son of a bitch <laughs> <laughs> Miller collection. Okay, uh, does that sound good? Or yeah, I think yeah. so. I think Am we're I supposed to some thoroughly neurotic characters, which I like. <laughs> yeah, like all of them have big chips on their shoulders. You think <laughs> that sounds accurate? Just that's very. Do I need? To, do we need to be carrying one of these? I know you don't have to have it on your person. No scalpel in his it. pocket or something. You don't need to have it on your person. I've seen some hideous old medical tools. Mm. I mean, now I'm... It doesn't specify that you have to have it on your... No, I I don't believe you need to have it. I think that there was something to do with sanity rolls. If you used a specific item or you went back to that thing, it will give you a bonus. That was in that video. Yeah, and and, and there's there's also things like a lot of what we're putting in here can be altered by the keeper so right. i think we should make it so they have to have something of it of, on their person okay i think that's a good idea to make it like and it's very special to them and it doesn't have to be the whole collection but maybe <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah i don't know <laughs> just a brief like case. Case curler or something or... it's just that all of the examples sound like something you would have on you 
Oh, like yeah. what? What are some of the examples? The examples yeah. Pardon? What are some of the examples? So from some of them, like an item with your higher skill, e.g. expensive suit, false ID, brass knuckles. So like a oh, memento wow, from right. your childhood, e.g. comics, pocket knife, lucky coin. So those all sound like things mm. like you would probably have them on you. Maybe not the comics. I mean, although, you know, could happen. Yeah. But most of these sound like something you'd have. Anyway, I don't think it matters too much. I've, I've just, for the moment, I've put the very first silicone injection plunger, which is a collector's, <laughs> a, a hell of a collector's yeah. item. Is that a silicone plunger in your pocket there? <laughs> uh, it can uh, increase people's lips. Okay, so traits. Uh, at the party, hey, those lips are looking a little bit flat. <laughs> I got a six. Oh, for... Traits. What? Traits. Uh, six. Oh, he's a good cook. Okay. Oh, there we go. G-Bex Bicycle Cakes can make a meal from almost nothing or refined pellet. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, refined paste is good. He pro- probably knows like all the weird celebrity diets as well. Uh, yeah, hundred yeah. percent. And he could probably get uh, reservations at fancy restaurants. How True. about that? Yeah. And make meals out of people's body parts. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> if you haven't cooked with uh, the <laughs> fat <animal> before. Like <laughs> You're like, oh, I didn't mention until now. I'm thinking of him as a criminal psychopath. One of the hobbies, I think, was serial killer. What? Um. Oh wait. <laughs> there was something that was like, oh, that's just like a Maybe straight up. You know what I bet you're thinking of? What? You're probably thinking of madness, like one of the madness things you can get. No, Turns like you into a- some of these things, like uh, con man, is a thing that you can have i thought i saw serial killer but i wasn't have occupation yeah yeah it's not an occupation ba- bank robber should i say finish all done yeah um and then once you've hit finish uh at the top there's an i oh, actually which actually it should just be a hit finish um there's like an edit switch at the top right of your character actually it's gone off the screen you might need to widen it a little bit <laughs> okay, it just stretches out the that's, whole thing. That's helpful. Um, uh, good, yeah, good. T- <laughs> <laughs> just keeps going. I, I oh, can... it's because I'm zoomed in, probably. Yeah, probably. So <laughs> maybe not. Just I, click I the no. just click the edit button at the top yeah. right there. Do you want me to click it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, you can put in a name and your occupation there oh, instead okay. of custom. Okay. Um, well, we did it. Well, we haven't done it all because <laughs> I need to know what what was your character's name. Oh yeah, we don't have a character name. Oh, what was the last name? Godwin. Oh no, God. That's the first name. Oh, what was the last name? God. Was it? <laughs> I, I thought it was Godwin. I thought Godwin was the his grandfather's. Oh, no, right. Oh no, yeah. No, it was Rod. Rodgin. Rodgin. Rod God. <laughs> I that know. was the grandfather. Uh, yeah, yeah. So there we might. Didn't you say it was thing, like but... Stewini? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was going to be Stewini. <laughs> My name will be Stewini. <laughs> Stewini Godwin. The no. third. The third. <laughs> love the, they love the name so much. They pass it down twice. <laughs> <laughs> Stewini, Stewini, Stewini. <laughs> Junior. No, um, I'm, I'm so confused. I can't even remember his grandfather's name. What it was, was Rod, it? Rodgin, wasn't it? Or Rod? What's his last name, though? Godwin. Yeah, you came up with it, too. I've forgotten. I thought it was Godwin. No, it's, but... in there, it's in there somewhere. Look, it's in the video. Yeah, Someone can... I'm not used to being a... I'll go a... down the... I can look at it for you, actually. I forgot. Here's my backstory. Um, <laughs> Here we go. Rodwin. Uh, Kingsom. So you probably Kingsom. Oh, yes. Kingsom. I must have missed Kingsom. Stewini Kingsom. <laughs> Stewini Kings. 
<laughs> Stuini is the shit he knows. No, what uh, like he just introduces himself it? as like Stu. He's like, oh hey, I'm yeah, I'm Stu. Uh, just S S Kingston. <laughs> Doctor Doctor Stu <laughs> Kingston. Really pretentious. Maybe he'd be like S R Kingston because yeah, yeah. I was his middle name Rodgen as well. His, he got his grandfather's middle <laughs> yeah, name for his middle name. That's why his grandfather really uh, paid a lot of attention. <laughs> Uh, at first, and then was constantly disappointed. <laughs> yeah, he's like, "Oh, this one's gonna—he's gonna be a great, a great man." And then as the be a lady oh, killer, <laughs> they're like, "But do, did, do you think yeah. is, is Stuini the right name for him?" He keeps asking <laughs> his daughter, Stuini. <laughs> oh, there's just a, it's just got a ring. It cannot to it. be Stuini. It doesn't fit. Is it? <laughs> it's an amazing name, though. We need it. So, so what does so he the, go by? Uh, What's that? What does he go by? Oh, yeah. He doesn't go by S, does he? Or does he? No, because it can't be Stuini. What should his name be? Oh, I'm stuck on Stuini now. Supina. Think... That's great. <laughs> Supina. Supina. Um... Stupendo. <laughs> Stupendo. Stupendo <laughs> Kingsom. Stupendo Kingsom. Uh, making up names is the best. It's got like a really pretentious name, like Seville or something. Oh, uh, Seville. No, 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 not like Jimmy Seville. Seville. So, <laughs> like Seville Row, the famous tailoring street in London. Uh, not Seville. The famous pedo from the well, no. that was, see, that was an unfortunate thing that came out after he'd already grown up, which only served to to make him feel even worse about himself. Seville. <laughs> Jimmy Seville Jr. <laughs> he used to be proud of his name and then everyone's like oh like the pedophile and he's like oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway so the name's jared fogel um mm. jared fogel <laughs> eat fresh everyone what's that no that's uh Sevine. um Seb. sebastian yeah sebastian that's good sebastian uh kingsome Weenie. Well, long live Stuini. <laughs> uh, junior. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. I suppose his dad could be Sebastian. Okay. And Ned, is there anything I need to do? I think, I think that's I think that's the character. Okay. I think we've got three of the four characters. We need. To, it was a shame we couldn't get John on tonight. So, um, at some point, yeah, long session though. <laughs> yeah, at some yeah, point. Um, Joe, you might have to jump online with John and take him through character creation at some time this week. Yeah, yeah, could do that. Um, now we've got it all figured out. Yeah. yeah. Did you watch that um, video? What's his name? We watched some yeah. of it. While we were having yeah, I, dinner. I think I'll have to watch it. A, I'll have to watch it a couple of times, I think. But he does a good job of making it less intimidating. Uh, yeah. Like Seth Skorkowski. I thought he was great. He um like yes, but also there's a lot of numbers involved. Oh, and yeah. like it's yeah. just the intensity of, I, of that. Annoyed, it was kind of annoying because I was like watching it and he's like so this is how you do it. Oh, but the alternate rule is this, and I chose to do it this way just at my discretion because I felt like it. And it's like, just tell me the way to do it. I, but I think he does do that just to let you know that, hey, it's not. It's like D&D. It's not set in yeah. stone. Mm. Yeah. It I mean, is up to, the, up to <clears throat> you. I find it really funny because you see people talking about how they roll characters in D&D and they're always like, okay, so I roll the first set of numbers and then I roll another one and then I add plus three and minus two and then I roll again and then <laughs> see which one is uh, average them all out, divide it by three and uh, add t uh, one D10. <laughs> Wait, do it normal. Why are you doing it like that? Yeah. <laughs> I just prefer things simple. What can I say? I think it's a way that people are like, I don't, I want to randomize my character, but have it only turn out good. Right. Don't you think mm. they're trying to like have their cake and eat it too? So I that they can be like, oh, if it, if, oh. What? You can't hear us? Can you hear me? We can, yes. but you can't hear us. Yeah, I yeah. can't hear you. This happened before and I had to quit. Yeah. <laughs> I can hear the ringtone though. Oh, that's, that's. It's just you I can't hear. That is Maybe very... I blocked you. Why'd you block us? <laughs> um, I don't know. 
We can hear each other. Awkward. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, we're. It's. Uh, zoop. That back to full screen. Um, so, how are you feeling about DMing now that we've got the characters sorted, Joe? Um, okay. I. I'm just going to be flying by the seat of my pants, and I'm, I've accepted that. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, and so I had a look. I had a quick look in the book that um, I purchased the the Christmas at Kingsport. There's no maps, so we won't okay. be using tokens and stuff. I guess it'll be all theatre of the mind. Um, oh, okay. Unless you wanted to like have a look over this again. This would be a lot of work, but you could look over it all and mm-hmm. um, find some maps or create some maps that might match. And create some tokens. The tokens is pretty easy. There are token makers that you can utilize. It's pretty simple to mm-hmm. do. So it comes down to what you want to do. So I've found that maps are good for helping people gauge distance yeah. and stuff. Otherwise, it's all theater of the mind, which is totally yeah, fine as well. Yeah, right. I like the maps. But yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, and it, or at least some sort of uh, photos of a setting. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's true. Oh, of speaking party. of photos... Can we figure out what the Sebastian looks like? Oh, yeah. Did we talk about? We did, though, right? Do we have a celebrity that comes to mind that we can steal a photo of? Because I kind of think it would be cool to get, like, 2000s. <laughs> Celebrities from 2000s. Yeah. It's a yeah. character. But who's, like, a solid 65 and looks like they've had too much work? That's harder to find for a male. Who was the actor well, from, like, The Wrestler? Um Yeah. Yeah, so I was Ricky Ricky too. Mork. Uh, Mickey Rourke, sorry. Ricky Martin. Oh, I'm Ricky Mork. <laughs> <laughs> Mickey Rourke. Mickey Rourke. He looks like he's had Ricky heaps Mark. of work. Uh, as, as, uh, like uh, today, Mickey now. But, um, Do you remember Carrot Top? How he went all crazy and got surgery, and now he looks very frightening? Mickey Rourke looks Carrot worse Top? now than he did when he was younger. <laughs> yeah, okay. he had all those lip injections. And yeah. Yeah. Um, I, well, I was originally thinking of. I oh, played Spartacus, you know, with the big chin. Uh, Spartacus. Is it Russell Crowe or am I? No, no, I'm much older than that. It's uh, Kirk Sorry. Douglas. Kirk oh, Douglas. He was in the thing. I, I, I can see Kirk Douglas as a 65. <laughs> I'm going to look him up. Oh, no, it, I think it, he does it. He's going for Kirk Douglas. Yeah, yeah. Uh, something's not quite right there. It's not a natural because Kirk Douglas was born that way. I know, but yeah, I could imagine that. Like, yeah. if you look at him, he's got very, oh. he's got features that looks like he's kind of had work. Like he's, like, it's weird if you look up photos. He's got like a, a the real dimpled chin. He's got these really yeah. strong cheeks. Uh, I reckon. Yeah, he's, he's pure like. Hollywood leading man of yeah, the time. But at the same time, and you see him in very a, much a 65. Yeah, they copy him in Ren and Stimpy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was way off. I was like, is that the guy who was in the thing? And I'm like, no, no. you're thinking Kirk Douglas. <laughs> wait, no, no, this is Kirk Douglas. Who am oh, I thinking wait. of? Uh, Kurt Russell. Kurt Russell. Kurt, okay, Kurt. okay, that's why. Yeah, so yeah Kurt. <laughs> Kurt Russell's. Awesome. Yeah, it's hard to think cool. of un, um, unattractive celebrities because, I don't know. Yeah. and they Movie stars are pretty attractive. But that's their role, isn't it? it is. with, like Someone who's like more on the fringes that's more like famous for their skills to find like the real weird looking people. Marty like, Feldman. Chefs and stuff. <laughs> Marty Feldman. Yeah. That's Who's like, that? that was, he's got these, he had that oh, um, I, thing I, with I, the I, eyes I, are out. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're young eyes. Frankenstein. Yeah, they? yeah. Well, that's a that's a good sixty five. The um the leading guy from Young Frankenstein. What's his name? Uh, Gene Wilder. Yeah, he thinks it's a sixty five. Doesn't he? Oh, uh, <laughs> maybe lower. What do you reckon? Higher or lower than a sixty five? I'd say he's lower. Poor Gene Wilder. I would say he's well, Above average attractiveness. Have you seen the producers, the no. original one with uh, no. him? It's probably the best movie and ever made. Haven't seen it. Okay, yeah, he's well, probably lost. I'll have to get it for you. I've got it on DVD. <laughs> we'll, it's we'll hilarious. Figure it out. 
I've I've heard of it though. I've heard it's like it's that one where they make a musical about Nazis, right? Yeah, and it's a Mel Brooks movie. Flop, oh right, I oh, do. Mel Brooks springtime for Hitler. Actually, I was just googling um, Gene Wild- Wilder, and I've come up with someone who I think is a bit weird looking. Elon Musk. He. I don't know if he's above. I don't know if he's a sixty-five. But he looks like he's trying so hard to be a 65 because he's super rich and he's not quite making it. Mm. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And if he'd had a little bit of work that hadn't got quite gone right. He's yeah, 100% he's someone, someone who will start getting... Everything. Oh, I'm looking through a list of... Um, what about Peter, Peter Boyle? I don't know Peter Boyle. I know him from Everybody Loves Raymond when he was really old. Yes. And he oh. was Frankenstein and young Frankenstein. <laughs> right. <gasps> Put it on the red. You've got to watch that scene even from young Frankenstein. <laughs> Yeah, All right. Sure. Okay. Well, now we're just evolving. Yeah, 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 yeah. We've look. We've done our characters. Three, <laughs> three of the four for the 2020 Getting Dicey Christmas special. Um, Shannon, like, I don't know if you realize how zoomed in your sh- like camera's been <laughs> all night. There we go. Um, also, I love how we're like pick a celebrity from the year 2000, and you're just like people Peter who are Boyle. hot in 1970. <laughs> no, 1930s. <laughs> Well, I mean, like, they yeah, were, like, well, yeah. celebrities in the 70s. Like, oh, <laughs> I didn't later. even think of, like, Hollywood now. I think they're all, they're you know, all like, copies of copies. You know mm. what would be a good, like, find a boy band, like, Sync and um, what's the other one? Backstreet Boys and pick yeah. a member from that. Yeah. Because they're trying so hard to be attractive, but most of them are not. They're about 65. Isn't there one that's, like, uh, classically, like, how the hell did he get in NSYNC? <laughs> Who's that yeah. guy? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I couldn't tell you any of the members of Insync, to be honest, let alone the one that shouldn't was, be there. Uh, I have to know now. All right, let's. <laughs> I was about to wrap up, by the way, but we can take a look at Insync. I reckon. Insync, such ah, oh, such nostalgia. There, look, there, there's the unattractive one. They're all. Pretty weird oh. looking, actually, now that I look at them. I'm looking at a picture of them, and two of them are wearing orange-tinted sunglasses, which is just... Cool. Just Frosted cool. tips. Yeah, man. Oh, it was Joe and Tony. That was the one that was like, why are you here? <laughs> how did you get in here? <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> how, did you, how did he? I bet he I could know. dance, man. I bet he could dance. But he's... In this picture, I'm saying he's got like the spiked hair, and it's like red at the tips. So I reckon he maybe he's a bad boy. I reckon he, he would have been able to dance pretty well. I reckon just really get the moves going. Did they even dance? Apart they from did like, like oh. nah, nah, heck your body. No, that's like dance back- moves and stuff. Oh, is that back to your point? I don't know. I think it is. But I, yeah, they, it, most they would turn around or something, right? <laughs> yeah, they nah, would. They I'm sure at some point they turn. Did around. they? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. Those those yeah, boy bands they I always mean, they in sync with yeah. each other. Yeah, all of the boy bands danced. <laughs> yeah, but I just remember them sort of like not. It's not like doing amazing dances like. Um, Are you wait, Justin wait, Timberlake is famous you. dancer, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. But he was a standout. I thought they could all move like JT. I just call him JT. <laughs> <laughs> if that were true, that'll be in the Mickey Mouse Club. That's they true. were all kind of his backup dancers, so they had to meet a standard of quality. Yeah. Right. Yeah. They, they had, had to be able to move at the same. They had to be in sync with him. That was like it's the in the minimum name. Man. <laughs> Guy Fieri was in there too, wasn't he? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> it's bringing the like, flavor I country. I remember him in the back there. Joey Fatoni looks like Guy Fieri. Exactly. Bobica says JT and TS are my favorite PSs. I'm not sure what a PS is. P. Postscript. (laughs) (laughs) In the chat, I've put in um, uh, the link to Young Frankenstein's putting on the Ritz if you need it. Well, let's put that in the chat in the Discord, actually. Let's (laughs) copy that. Copy that. We'll put that in here. Sync pictures in the oh wow that's okay it did a bizarre weird i hate oh. how things do that 
let's do this so you don't click weird things. What? Um, so PS was pop stars. So JT and TS were uh, his favorite pop stars. Who is here? Who who do you, who could it be? Tyrone Taylor Swift. Oh Taylor, Taylor. Swift. No. What? It might be. <laughs> Maybe. I was gonna throw someone Stuini. <laughs> it's not really my wheelhouse, I guess. <laughs> yeah, you're not into pop pop stars? Some of them. I probably stopped in the eighties. Tyrone Simmons. Did I say I said Tyrone? Isn't that the name I you just threw did. out there? Jesus. Who I is it? I don't know. It was just the first name I could think of that started with a T. Who is it? I, hear, I bet he's from a boy band. You watch. Uh, it's Tyrone Simmons. Is an American fencer? Wait a second. I think. I think they're uh, pulling my crowd. There's no Tyrone Simmons. They're <laughs> pulling your leg. They are. <laughs> But they got me. They got me good. I threw out a Tyrone and Bobakus was just like, I'm going to make him feel like he got it right. I'm seeing so many pictures of NSYNC and I have to send a bunch of them to the Discord. There's so much. There's so much hair situation going on. I'm entranced. Richard Simmons. <laughs> Is that Richard Simmons? <laughs> no, that's, that's uh, 45. Richard Simmons. <laughs> Not hey. a 65. <laughs> <laughs> Man, would, he would be an amazing that would, that would, of Cthulhu. Oh yeah, yeah. Richard Simmons. He was pretty big in the two thousands as well. He was making his like comeback in the two thousands. Yeah. I think I saw a documentary about how he was being like bullied into not leaving his house or something. Yeah. I listened to a whole series of podcasts yes. about someone trying to get into contact with Richard. I Simmons listened to those as well. He just disappeared from his um gym and everything like that and they were trying to figure out why. Yeah. That was an amazing podcast. Yeah. Well, did they figure out why? No, it, en so. it ended up with them just being like completely shut out by his like um, caregiver or something. They were worried, uh, you know, has his caregiver been mean to him or stuff? But I don't think there was any sort of answer. Yeah. It was interesting while it lasted, though. And he, he made like some kind of statement as well, being all like, I, I am fine and my caregiver mm. is not abusing me or something. Like doing the blinking. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, yes, let's, no wrap, <laughs> let's, um, let's wrap it up. We're going to be live uh, 2 p.m. I think 2 p.m. I think we're going to go live 2 p.m. next Sunday, New Zealand time. So, oh, so that should be really cool. That'll be our Christmas special or the Christmas special, as we like to call it. Uh, Joe, I'm really excited to see you have a go as Keeper. This is going to be great. I'm excited to be a player again. It's been a while. I just want everyone to keep an open mind to it being absolutely appalling in totally. a train wreck. Okay? I think I think you are a hundred percent going to be better than you think you will. Just just trust yourself. Just have fun and just go with all the crazy we'll shit all be that is going to be pretty happening. Pretty drunk. Oh yeah, we will be drinking. Oh, nice. That will help. That will help. <laughs> um, it's Christmas. Yeah, it's Christmas. You got to. So we'll see you. Hopefully, yeah, my second day on holiday. So nice. It'll be mine oh. too. Mine too. Everyone's paused. What? Oh, Joe's connection has oh. died but that's um, right uh so yeah. we will see you guys all hopefully there next sunday you guys will be there john will be there and um and adam will be there and we'll see you all then so not the same time next time just next time sunday see you guys then thank you so much for Different watching time. see you around.